see me right now, I've had to fiddle a little bit with Streamlabs OBS, and I'm sorry if there's a change in quality. Like, I am checking out my uh, own channel right now, and I'm just getting my screen. Uh, this is a little unusual for me, I'm sorry about that. I'm working on getting the, my webcam right now, but I could not wait any longer. <laughs> I'm tired of being late. Uh, I'm trying to overlay my webcam. It's capturing me. My webcam is working. It's just, like, with OPS, I have to set it up so that the webcam is layered on top of uh, my video screen. Uh, so let's see here. If I just open up the webcam frame, it should give me the option. Mode image when not showing. No, that, it's not giving me any options here. If I go down to, say, webcam and just double-click that, nope. Uh, so, uh... <laughs> I, I guess my, my smiling face isn't going to be a feature for this stream, and I'm sorry about that. Uh, we're just uh, <laughs> going to hop right into Skyrim here. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm sorry once again. Like, I kind of rushed in here at the last minute. I had to cook for everybody again today, you know, it's, it's the usual deal. And, um, well, uh, I got a new oil fryer. Uh... <laughs> I, I put in a little bit too much oil, a few of you might be able to see where this is going. <laughs> and, uh, well, it, uh, uh, displacement and thorough dynam dynamics combined, uh, well, they got me. <laughs> I, I made quite a big mess, and I had to spend a lot of time cleaning that up, and that's my bad, I'm sorry about that. Oh, it looks like that when the screen goes away, you can see my face. This is the most unusual shit ever. <laughs> I'm sorry about this, guys. Oh man, I'm really sorry about this, guys. <laughs> I'm laughing right now, but that's just to hide my pain. But mostly I'm just laughing at myself. And it looks like OBS wasn't loaded when I took up Skyrim. That's a shame. I gotta go through Tax Manager real quick. Just bring that back up in case I get to see any of you guys today. Uh, the music you're hearing is my girlfriend going hard. She's got, uh, uh looks like <laughs> some hit training going on. Jesus trying to stay motivated. Yeah, that was Space Jam. Mixed with the boss battle song from uh, Dark Souls 1, Ornstein and Smog. It's one of her favorite tunes. Alright, uh, with that out of the way. Oh, yeah, that, yeah, it's giving me all this business right here. I can't even tell. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm woefully underprepared as usual. <laughs> Only one minute late. <laughs> I'm just reading your comments, Sour Patch. Yeah, I need. To, I'm gonna try to figure out how to get most <laughs> timers myself. Uh, I might have. Oh fuck! I have to adjust the frame rate, bit rate, etc. <laughs> I know, man. It's just one thing after another, isn't it? You can just barely see me when I pop up. <laughs> I'm laughing, but I don't like delivering this kind of inconsistent quality. It, it really is embarrassing. Like, I'm sorry you won't be able to get my... Uh, yeah, yeah. I, ne I needed some hype juice for this. Oh, shit. And uh, my controller is dead. <laughs> this is a great start to the stream, man. And I've got... Yeah, yeah, th this isn't the right charger cable. Uh, DMC cables. Why couldn't we have just stopped this at micro USB, huh? What was wrong with the micro USB? Why did we have to go with the C cables? Yeah, right, it kind of pops in and out. Like, I, I can't figure out how to overlay it permanently on top of my display capture. Or at least I, I didn't really have the time to figure it out before, well, you know, I, I was going to be late again. <laughs> I'm really trying to stay on time. That's one of the big things I'm emphasizing this run through. Run through. But uh, now I'm running into an entirely different issue. <laughs> My controller is charging, but uh, it, it's it's not syncing now. It's not turning on. This is wonderful. I might just have to go and steal one of my roommate's other controllers that's actually charged. Mother of shit. Hey, broken mouse. <laughs> I'm glad you could join us, man. I won't talk about the maze if you don't. 
I think you could use a break from that. And I'd like to apologize to you too for not having the video, my webcam display capture up. And yeah, I'm, I'm trying my best to get the stand controller running, but it, it won't do the thing. Here we go. Here we go. Alright, I think I got it. I think I got it. Alright, I believe I did a bit of inventory management last time, so I should be all good to go. And yeah, unfortunately, I think 268 is about as low as I can get it. Like, I have a lot of food items and all of this jewelry. I'm going to have to do some enchanting today. <laughs> like, I mean, it wouldn't hurt. It's like, it's not that I didn't prepare for anything or that I didn't give consideration to anything. I want to be clear about that. Like, I was really rushing at the end. It's just that, like, th things... Like, I, I... I calculate to the exact minute... And I'm really bad at math. <laughs> it's like, is that is that a decent explanation? I just have to give myself time. That's the real problem that I'm running into here, is that, like I, like I, underestimate the tasks that I have at hand, and I overestimate to uh, like how quickly I can perform them. <laughs> Oh man, below is the highest viewers section of Twitch. <laughs> yeah, I think you're one of the highest viewers here. I, I can't say in other, any other stream, my brother. Oh, like it occurs to me, I'm going to have to really read everything you write out loud just so you know that I read it and I'm actually reacting this time. Oh man, this is... Like, guys, I, I've delivered some janky streams in the past, and I'm sorry about that, but this is probably my jankiest yet. <laughs> I, I think that it displays, uh, like, is it just me, or is, is there, like, a small rectangle that's highlighted in the bottom of my screen? Like, I see this small rectangle, and I just want to know, is that just me, is that just my OBS, or do you guys see that too? Because I'm going to have to do something about it that, that if it's also in your screen. <laughs> New high score. Yeah, we're breaking records every day on this channel. Either for the... Either we're getting more viewers every day or I get the longest, most awkward pauses. Nothing? Awesome. Glad to hear it, guys. Then, with that, I got to swing by White, White Run real quick. And what I mean by the planes today is I'm going to be doing all of the dungeons I can within this area right here between the mountain and uh, White Run. Yeah, it's there. Oh, some broken mounts is fucking with me. <laughs> Hold on a second. Then I got the. I have to bring up Task Manager again. I have to check this out. Oh, hello. Oh, and I'm gone again. Fuck. See, it's there. <laughs> I just don't know how to make display capture go underneath it. Let's see here. If I can... Yeah, if I disable display capture, then you can see me. But uh, that's only if I disable it. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Maybe if I... No, it just it gives me the option to switch displays in my curse capture. Okay. No. <laughs> Oh man. Guys, why are you messing with me like this? Like I'm, I'm like I seriously can't tell myself. Okay, the header's there. Alright, so that might work. Header should tell you guys if we get new followers if we or anything like that. Uh but uh let's see the label that's the the uh that's the box that's being highlighted below there. And I think that's what uh was uh like this is it? Oh, now that's actually pretty cool. I didn't know that, man. All right, uh, it's gone away on my screen. Has it gone away on your sour patch? Get to see my bald, smiling face one more time before we get back into it. Oh shoot! And I actually have to see because we only have two followers. I should have mine selected. I'm really trying to get affiliate here, so every view counts, including my own. So on my stream on my channel here it says that I have three followers okay so that's working too I can never tell with this thing because I had to reset my catch <laughs> I, I had to clear out my catch and reset my history and all that while I was trying to troubleshoot 
uh, the problems with the extensions. And as I put in stream announcements, uh, like I've essentially narrowed it, uh, the uh, extensions and plugins issue down to it being a stream uh, uh, Streamlabs OBS thing. Oh my goodness, this is the story. <laughs> it's like I have to do it one more time. I forgot to put it back to me. <laughs> Alright, essentially my client here uh, that I use for streaming called Streamlabs uh, has an exclusionary contract. Yeah, yep, I still am. I Like, I knew I wouldn't have enough time to uh, set up a new OBS. Like, I need to research and make sure that I don't get one that has another exclusionary clause. Because essentially, uh, the permissions that uh, you have to grant uh, to Streamlabs OPS overrides all other extensions that aren't related to Streamlabs. So I'm a stack essentially stuck only using Streamlabs extensions. And uh, I'm still having issues with uh, like configuring a Streamlabs extension. You might see on my channel in the About Me that I have a Streamlabs leaderboard up. But that Streamlabs leaderboard, um, like, I am able to actually access the control panel, but unfortunately, uh, it won't let me save any of the options that I select, so I can't adjust it in any way. And it's still giving me the loading screen of death. <sighs> yeah, if I sound disappointed about it, it's because I am. <laughs> like, I, I've, I've been... Uh, like, I tried to contract uh, uh, Twitch support about all of this, and they essentially just gave me, like, they, they, they gave me a, a fucking manual from their website. They, they just copied and pasted, like, the uh, tutorial section, and it, it was great. It was really helpful. Thanks, thanks Twitch. <laughs> Yeah, I might have to switch to OBS. I have uh, to play in OBS. I have uh, OBS Studio that I haven't properly set up. I think it would be in my interest if I switched to that. Uh, but uh, it uh, might be interesting to explore all the capabilities of Streamlabs first. They do offer a few things like bits that I'm interested in. Though I understand I could probably run bits with any other OBS software. And I'm trying to make the comments sen section a bit more interactable, give you guys something to do while you're hanging out with me. There are a couple of mini-games that I have in mind <laughs> that uh, I'll be talking to a friend of mine about over the weekend here. And uh, besides Saturday, it might be that I don't stream again until Monday, uh, simply because I get to play Dungeons & Dragons with my girlfriend and all of her friends tomorrow, and she's going to be running as Dungeon Master. I'm, I'm really looking forward to it, man. <laughs> I'm gonna have to be on mobile. That's fine, man. Like, I should be able to handle most things that require any kind of moderation. Like, giving, giving you the sword next to your patch is just giving you the props you deserve, bro. You know what I mean? It, it, gives, you, it, it gives you that status. So you don't have to take that role too seriously, though. I do appreciate you for it. You know what? I should have sold all these rings to Farangar, but I don't give a shit. I'm already out of there, so I'm... <laughs> yeah, no, like I was saying, you don't have to worry about modding too much. I understand that you're an individual who takes your role seriously, but we're still a small channel, and I'm not anticipating anybody like going crazy in here just yet. Alright, and uh, I'm uh, also, like, I trust almost all the guys who come onto this stream... Lots of lots of you really have good heads on your shoulders and your hearts are in the right places. And uh, I know that if somebody comes in here and tries to stir up shit, then you know it's not going to rile you guys and I'll have the time to be able to put the band hammer on them. Alright. So I just got to unload the rest of my shit. I'm going to need these. I, I really want to keep these. It's only one carry weight and it gives me that 20% bonus. Let's see if I can apply that. No, all of these are enchanted except for the helmet. And I think I put my one steel ingot away. Um, maybe I could just buy another one real quick. <laughs> I love you too, babes. She really kicked booty over there. Like, she's lying in a puddle of her own sweat currently and it's amazing. Mace! <laughs> yeah. It's still solid, man. It's solid as a rock. You haven't let that maze break you yet, mouse. 
I'm not letting the name fool me. I know you're really mighty. Yeah, he likes to do that. Yeah, the cat's like, I see you're in pain. I'm coming over here to feed off of you. I'm here to feed off your sorrow and your misery. <laughs> it always seems like whenever I'm down here working out, it's like Kinsey, like the smaller of our two cats, comes over and he's just like, he's drinking it in, man. He's happy. He likes to watch us suffer. And it's like, yes, you can't run anywhere. Now you have to spend all of your time with me. With me. <laughs> Yeah, I wouldn't recommend it. Oh like Sour Patch, I think that if you download Streamlabs that it might interfere with uh, some of your like viewing capabilities too. Like I just let that be a me thing. I'm d I'm gonna deal with that. I I'm making some progress on figuring this out, but I do appreciate all the help you've been giving. Though I know that if you really want to adjust it I can't stop you, man. Like I I know how you get about one troubleshoot things. Alright. I'm not gonna be able to kill any of these giants yet. But I can loot the shit out of their chest. So let's get it. And we already took care of Meridia's beacon. So I don't have any of that unpleasantness from uh, our chest here. If I can just get this right, here we go. Is it just me, or is this joystick just a little touchy today? It's probably just me. Here we go. And it's like, it, it going anywhere but the lockpicking... Oh, oh god! He's angry! I'm taking your cheese, bitch! Ah, shit! <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. I, I saw your comments on the general chat. Like, you're thinking about streaming your, like, uh, your truck driving? I think that's actually a pretty good idea. If not stream, then at least have a video camera that can capture certain moments. Like, it might not be that you want to stream the entire trip, but if you're recording and you happen to see something weird or funny, like, then that might be worth your time to take a second to upload that. Or if you just want to go on long rants, that's also pretty fun to watch. Like, that's what I did whenever I was driving up to my base. Is I, I would just take the time to rant, to rant into the air about whatever was bugging me. Like, these bandits. These assholes. <laughs> oh, no, and I'm back here. Damn it, my auto saves. Alright, I'm gonna have to go back to that giant's camp and take his cheese all over again, man. Yeah. That too, bro. <laughs> he just ran away. Ah, oh, Kinsey's abandoned her. She's all alone. She has nobody there beside her. Yeah, that's what you get. <laughs> the kitty. That, that cat, he's self-serving. He's a traitor. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think... We're gonna clip the cheese moment, I think, Broken Mouse. Uh, <laughs> hopefully you can catch when I get shot. <laughs> God damn it. Like, of course I'd get shot right away. Just gonna skip the business with Farangar this time. I got nothing to disenchant. So we're gonna spawn right outside the White Run stables. Quick save and go from there. Already back up to 4,000 coins. Like, God, it's easy to make money fast in this game if you're a klepto like me, man. <laughs> Love you too, babes. Good job with your workout over there. Yeah, plenty. Help yourself. Thank you. I really need to not Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> Appreciate you, Sour Patch. Oh, uh, shit. Oh, yeah, the problem is when you get phone calls, it shuts everything down. 
Yeah, like, hmm, that's because you use it. Yeah, it's because you're using your phone as a hotspot. That sucks, bro. Then maybe place it on do not disturb mode unless you, like, you don't want to piss your wife off. <laughs> okay, maybe don't put it on do not disturb mode. Just ask nicely, like, honey, I'm trying to stream. <laughs> oh god, I know what hell I'd catch if I put my phone on like that whenever I was gone. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, I think this time I can get out of here without aggro on these guys. Oh wait, no, he looks angry. Uh, that's, that's a nice giant, good giant. Okay, stay over there. I'm gonna take the cheese again, bitch. Okay, he didn't mind. He didn't mind. This time I got the cheese and I got away with it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna quick save and get the hell out of here. <laughs> Next off is a drag or two, man. Got this whole plane to raid today. Ooh, silent moons. Think this one's silent moons. Gonna have to watch out for the bandits. Thought he was gonna go after me for a second. And can I just say, like, these mammoths have some fucked up teeth. Look at those tusks, man. That, that's a little bit overkill. I, I I think four is too many. It's not it, it's not historically accurate. It's, it's not immersive. Oh, I understand. I understand 100%. Well, as much as I can. Oh shit, I'm not gonna win with this. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get in there and mix things up. Just have to use her as a bullet sponge. Alright. And Farangar's taking the L's over there. Yeah, that's exactly what I plan on doing, my friend. Though I have a lot of gems, and I kinda just wanna hoard material wealth. I'm gonna get up to enchanting. I'm gonna get my enchanting up fast enough, you know? I don't need to turn everything I find into jewelry. Like, just having all of, like, those gems and ingots just sitting there. So, I guess just having the ingots will be nice. I don't know. Like, I like hoarding just about everything, not just the booze, man. Hold on a second. If I can download anything useful, girlfriend coming to chill with us for a little bit. Regeneration. I think this might be good. No, 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 not yet. I don't need that. Let's see. All right. Like, uh, do I have anything heavy armor? Here, here we go. Level thirty. Let's go with. I can't use well fitted yet, but. Uh, well, yeah, this would work. Well fitted. Oh, see, so you guys are the culprits. Damn mud crabs. Like, they hit surprisingly strong. Weirdos, man. Only weirdos don't like hoarding shit. Like, I don't have problems. They have problems. Like, if you don't like collecting random shit, do you really play Skyrim? Why do dragons hoard things? Why do dragons hoard things? I don't know. For the same reason why the Dragonborn likes to hoard shit. Fans. <laughs> You're absolutely right, man. I, I, I really should. <laughs> like, you know what? That's one for the bucket list. That's one that I haven't ever finished yet. It's the Stones of Baron Zaya. I think I'm going to make it a special point to get those done this playthrough. Oh, boy. But that's going to involve starting a few quests, and I'm also trying to keep my quest tab relatively clean, otherwise it's going to be hard to, to sort through everything. I guess that's not quite as important to me, though. Let's get these fucking gems after I get transmute. And silent moons. Oh, what the hell, we're going to get it all. I know the book's up there. I, I know that the Silent Moon's Enchantment Blade is up there, but first I want to clear out this little area and grab all of the booze they have. 
All of it. 100% of it. We're getting all the boots. Don't you dare. Have you ever thought of naming your two weapons? Inter invention? Intervention? No. I thought it's a good, a good idea for dual weapon. I can't name shit this game. That's right. But this is Dawnbreaker. Dawnbreaker is always going to be Dawnbreaker. I can't just re-enchant Dawnbreaker and make it booty rammer. Okay. Um, can, can I, like, Sour Patch for... I think I can understand the mythology behind dragons hoarding things, but it's just sort of like... They're hoarding stuff that would not have any type of value to them anyway. It's like a dragon's gonna, like, suddenly start spending points. Like, can you imagine a modern-day no. dragon? Like, he's hoarding, like, all the James Charles palettes or something like that? No, it has nothing to do with that. It's more like how Crow is, like, picking up shiny stuff. It's exactly like that. Dragons are just giant birds, and they like the shinies. It shines, and they want it. And they like the jingly noises. So they sleep on it. Yeah. Okay, like, like that... Power. That, that's just my opinion. That That's my theory. Dragons are just big-ass crows, and they like the shinies. Am I throwing poppy seeds at it? Oh my god, that would be hell if I'm a vampire now. This makes me sound <laughs> like, 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 when I was in high school, I went through, like, an edgy-ass phase where I thought, I was like, oh, I want to be a freaking vampire, though. And it's just like, all right. Um, it, you know, because like Twilight was out, like vampires were like super popular. Even though I didn't really like Twilight that much. I Can you imagine like, vampire throwing a bunch of beads at uh, at at, at uh, whatever his name is, like the, the, the shiny one, the sparkly? Throw a bunch of beads at the sparkly one, and he just stopped. He's like one, two, three. Ah ah ah, ah Bella! I'm them. coming Sand for that boot. Oh, four. Five, six. <laughs> like, uh, that's funny. I like I I think I've heard that at some point, but it's been so long, man. That <laughs> oh shit. The idea of that just makes me funny. It makes me laugh. Not me funny. Just words, man. I'm bad with them tonight. I'm bad with words in general. Oh fuck! Broken Mouse is getting back into maze mode. Stay with us, Broken Mouse. Is he stay, into a piece of corn? Stay away from the light! Hang with the dark hang in here with the darkness. We have popcorn. Oh so that's jack o' lanterns. <laughs> that's funny, man. Mm -hmm. So if a vampire yeah. sees a car of punk and he's like, hmm, other brother got dibs, I can't be here. I don't want to mess with the count. <clears throat> oh man. <laughs> if that so if the creators of Showery Brown were to have um Maze. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Corn. So he So if we throw a bunch of corn at Broken Mouse, will he stop to count it? Will that let us get away? Oh my god. No, he's turning into a giant labyrinth TC. <laughs> <laughs> Lighting systems in the maze. We don't want to break this man. Sounds like the maze is already driving him on edge. So, okay, say... Like, the great, the creators of Charlie Brown were to actually connect it to the vampire mythology that you just told us about. Wrong, the great, wrong show, babes. The great Sesame pumpkin, Street. Oh. The great pumpkin would be claimed by the biggest and most baddest vampire that has ever lived, ever, and has lived for, like, since the beginning of time, and he would be a huge-ass caveman. So the great pumpkin is claimed by the Count. And the Count counted all the seeds himself. One, Not any count. Two, three. The count to end all counts. Count Chocula? He has lived longer than Kane. Alright, looks like I already got the line armor foraging. 
So count Chocula. No, he is a cat that is so old we have no knowledge of him yet. Wouldn't that work in reverse? It's like if he's so old, then wouldn't he be part of history? It would be, but like... Count Chocula. Well, like, like, you know, he basically... Like, maybe he just basically was like living a life as like a normal person to like kept, keep low. The pumpkin is just a pumpkin. Okay, so the Great Pumpkin is not a minion of the greatest vampire alive. No. Damn. That would be so cool. <laughs> I don't get why vampires are always like trying to be like all like fucking royals and shit either. Royals? Why not? I it's mean, like it's they so live forever. They have to have a taste for the finer things. I know. Oh, but... vampires use magic to make them do stuff. Oh. So they control the pumpkins. So the Great Pumpkin would be controlled by a powerful vampire, but the Great Pumpkin is not like, you know... A... The Great Pumpkin is but a minion. But He's a but a servant to Count Chocula. And it's not the most powerful vampire either. It could just probably be any, uh, any powerful-ish vampire, I yes. guess. Okay. I don't know what Booberry be. Oh man, single mud crab almost kicked my ass and I got four more to go. How come these mud crabs are so damn strong? Cause crab right. Sour Patch is asking what you mean. Or you asking what I mean or what uh, the girl here means? My lady friend. There's, I... Okay. What you mean. Okay. Yes, I understand that now. Basically, the Great Pumpkin is being controlled by a vampire, but the pumpkin, the Great Pumpkin does not have any innate power. But the vampire is probably controlling the Great Pumpkin in order to be like, in order to scare the crap out of the Charlie Brown kids. Like, so, this business. vampire who is controlling the Great Pumpkin is in it for the lulls, is what you're saying. I don't know, maybe. <laughs> if you want to have this discussion, it needs to be in voice chat. I can't keep typing this much on my damn phone. <laughs> damn it, I have like so many questions to ask about this. I have never heard of this before. Like, I also have a lot of other questions about vampires too. Like, why are they always like depicted as royalty? Yeah, in order for both, uh, in order for both Psycho Cat and I to hear that though, I would have to take, uh, like the audio off my headphones and put it through the television. And then the audio from the television would reverberate through my microphone here. So while you and I could have a conversation over Discord while I'm streaming uh, Sour Patch, like, uh, I w like, uh, Psycho Cat here would have to hop on her laptop and hop on, on a Discord and have this as a three-way conversation. And, yeah. Is that something you want to mess with tonight, babes? I do, but I have to take a shower first. Yeah, she might she might top on later on. Yes. <laughs> the only power it has is having great in the name. Yeah, basically broken mouse. Hmm. It just pretended. So that pumpkin's a poser. Yeah, poser ass pumpkin. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, she will later tonight after a shower, man. Oh fuck! I'm not going out by crab. Damn it! I'm not Aqua Team Carl, man. I'm not going out to crabs. If you do, I'm gonna play Crab Rave. <laughs> I just have to keep playing clips of Carl from Aqua Team. Nah, I wish I could, man. Like these aren't AirPods, bro. Like these, this is just a headset. All right, answer the royalty question, my friend. Damn it, now I can actually hear the Crab Rave song playing in the back of my head. Oh, don't, don't, no, this is already awful. Please, no. Oh, God. God. Fuck you, Crab. All right, here we go. Man, I'm already at level 65. Oh, <laughs> hell no. Any of AirPods? No, it still has an aux cord, bro. That's so ghetto. 
I, I would have to like duct tape them to each one of her ears. They wouldn't stick. They're not pods, bro. It's a headset. Okay, the crabs are dead. It was an epic battle that lasted five minutes. For some reason. I got it. I'm so weak in this playthrough, dude. I've got like 170 health and I have like three perk points already invested in heavy armor. Like five perk points and a one-handed and I'm getting my ass kicked by mud crab still. What the hell? If you were morally Yeah. So that's why you usually a count or like a baroness of some kind. So it's attract the attention of uh, wealthy human nobles. That makes sense. Smash the headphones and they'll fit in my ears. Yeah, I'll just crumple them up. I'll, I'll twist them into little balls. They'll still work. Oh, Dustman's Cairn. I'm gonna have to come back here with Farkas later on. Can't go in there yet. Them into your skull. That's what you gotta do. Yeah. Oh, the Skelly Boys. Okay, we're gonna fight some Skelly Boys. This plane's conquering, it's going by rather quickly. Hmm. So back then, they did, they still had like semi anonymous rich people. It's just more like. Yeah. It's more or less like only like title and name. Yeah. And like. Vlad Tepe, <laughs> man. Beyond the rumors and uh, like the impalings, like. He, he was hated in Romania, like, mostly because he was unconquerable in battle. Like, Vlad Tepe was uh, known throughout the region for being a warlord and for having a large and uh, formidable force, but not just for having a large, formidable force. Like, his castle was nearly insurmountable. It was on this really steep cliff, like, in the, the Alps of Romania. And, uh... Like, the only way you could reach it was through the front gate. Otherwise, on each side of the walls, it was just sheer. Like a sheer drop-off that went for thousands of feet. Incapable of getting a siege engine of, or uh, of undermining the castle in any way, shape, or form. You would have to have professional mountaineers scale the thing to even gain access to the front gate. well-known guy in history that was an earl in the royal hierarchy? Yeah, I believe so. Uh, you're gonna have to be a, a, a bit more like that, that's known as a vampire too? Wait. No, like in the, in the royal hierarchy. I think it's like king, um, king slash queen, duke slash duchess, and then the counts slash countess. He traveled constantly, was friends with tons of kings and queens, was allowed to pass through the every Western European country. That rings a bell. It was. Mm, what was the time era? Was uh, that in the same time era as Vlad Tepe, or is that like more Renaissance? Is that Vlad the Impaler? No, Vlad the Impaler is a king. Never mind. Yeah, Vlad, the, Vlad Tepe was uh, uh, a lord in his own right. Damn it, I'm just... Oh, this is a master lock. No wonder, I thought this is expert, so I was reading it wrong. Alright, I'll get it now. There we go. So... Ooh, speechcraft. Gonna have that along with my helmet, my clavicus vial. Ooh, alright, I already have to travel back to White Run and sell some shit. Just a farmer that robbed a count and took a few outfits. <laughs> That's beautiful. And I love that. That guy sounds iconic. Masterful bullshitter. Nobody bothered to check his credentials. Right. It's like, yeah, he seems like he fits in here. Right. Ah, before the days of ID and passports. What a life to live. Nowadays with facial recognition. Like, forget about it. You wouldn't be able to pull anything like this off. <laughs> and that that has to be a liberating feeling man I'm envious of that the guy who murdered Hisashi also kind of like did a little bit of the same thing 
Oh, he, he claimed to be a count and robbed an earl. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I can't remember which one is higher. Is earl the higher title or is count? I believe it's count. I believe it's count? Yeah. Lady friend here says it's a count. I'm inclined to believe her. <laughs> like, I know that the uh, main titles surrounding, like, the second lowest in command, I mean, the second, like, Murder like, the second time. highest in command to the, Fuck uh, you, Nazim. You Why are you running? To the king is, uh... I'll take all you bitches on. I'll offend all betrayed me. The duke slash duchess. But it's nice knowing you offend all, but you have to die now. Banksy? Banksy. The heck was... Okay. Not going down without a real fight. <laughs> oh shit. Not Fondle. <laughs> What's up, Sammy Hammy? Banksy. <laughs> Is that a typo? <laughs> Not Fondle. Not much, man. Mm. Random murder hope of time. Don't really care where this goes, I'm just gonna see it. Like, how far can I go with this murder hobo run? Mm. Probably not far, I'm already dead, basically. Done with the maze already? Oh yeah, it's over. So we got mm. Fondle. We killed mm. Fondle. And we killed Nazim. He would have looked a lot better that would be a good example if he had of himself a pop of door. If there was one. Good example of a vampire? Like a modern day vampire. Because as far Count as Dracula. I... No, like, you know, you'd want to, like, cover your identity, right? Yeah. Doesn't that make sense? If... Goths? Nah, they're, they're too obvious. That's too easy. They're too obvious. It's like, if I were a vampire, I wouldn't be a goth, man. Like, that's just asking for attention. Probably a valley girl. No, they're no. too tan. Too tan? Yeah, they live... They valley live. girl's too tan. Yeah. Oh, so counts under Earl. Okay. Oh, right. Oh. All right, so, he'll be knight, so he'll be knight, countess, um, I don't know what Earl is. Marquis, I don't know what Duke, is. Prince. Duchess, princess, queen. Hmm. I'm going to trust you completely on this one. And it took me a minute there to recognize that Doug Doug reference, Sammy Hammy. So I'm sorry, it's been a minute since I've seen a Doug Doug video. Oh, I'm looking him up right now. It's the guy who painted the uh, girl with the umbrella, right? I mean, girl with the balloon. I really don't know who Banksy is yet. I, like, I'm, I'm a bit of an ignorant motherfucker. Probably like a dark academia <laughs> type. Like, I can imagine that. Maybe you would be, like, correcting all the history books. <laughs> it's like, no, that's not what happened. Hold on a second. Yeah. Like, a vampire, you're right, I think would have to be an introverted type. Would be a bit of a shut in, a recluse. Do you think a vampire would be a Weebo? Do you think the modern vampire would be a Weebo? Oh, my gosh. No, okay, then Weebos are kind of shy, so not a Weebo. Well, they could probably be someone who goes to, like, conventions... Weeb for sure? Yeah. Like a convention going Weebo. That'd be perfect. I mean, he could probably... Yeah, Alright, we're homing in on this guy. I have three pickaxes. That's where a lot of carry Man, I love from. his artwork. I remember seeing a couple of pictures of, um, of this like wandering on Facebook at one point. Who? What? Who? What? Banksy? Banksy? Yeah. Oh, so you know who Banksy is. I I'm just the only one in the dark. Oh. Oh, the street artist. Yeah. I remember seeing that picture everywhere, the one with the girl with her balloon. Alright, so Sour Patch Asena would be a professor. I could also see that. Like a history professor, right? <laughs> history professor, but that's almost too obvious. Not a history professor, like an English professor. You'd overlook an English professor, but you'd be suspicious of... Uh, You'd be suspicious of the history professor. But they would make the best history professors ever, ever, because, like, 
they'll just they'll just literally yeah. teach the actual history as it is. It's just like no, that's not that's not what happened. Like, why are you people getting it wrong? Yeah, the professor would have to have an underground room for sure. Only teach night classes. Yeah, but you're right. Living inside like that that that's more support for the weeb because weebs live at night. They live in the forums. None at all. <laughs> no. None, but like you know, it, it's one of those things. Those who can't do teach. He he would like correct. He would like kind of like correct correct it like um. He probably sort of like teach off the book a little bit, and then we'll just be like, okay, so back yeah. in like. Okay, no, that's not how the dark like, ages. Like a, a vampire would have to go to parties. That's how he's gonna mark victims. Right. So like, you, you got to get the idiot who drinks himself into a stupor. Pull him behind a dumpster real quick. Yeah. Yeah, like modern, like uh, that date rapist. No. What's his name? He was famous for getting let off the hook. Only got like three months. What's his name from Florida? Or was it Florida? Yeah. Probably wouldn't work. If, like, you were an immortal vampire, you'd probably have a fat nest egg at this point. Like, you wouldn't have to work. Yeah, just like a vampire with a cave of bitches. But eventually, like, he would get caught. You can't have too many. You, 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 gotta, you gotta be willing to dump bodies in different counties. But nowadays, they have a bunch of, like, forensics and... They have a lot of different ways of solving murders and um, looking into things. Alright. So he might have to be a government but employee. Vampires wouldn't have real blood. Do they even have fingertips? Think Like, do they have fingerprints? I believe if you can actually, like, touch things, then you can have fingerprints. I guess, yeah. But would they even have records of this guy's fingerprints? Like, if he's thousands of years old, like, mm -hmm. he's got to find ways... Every once in a while, sell a priceless work of art. Yeah. I can imagine that just living off of, like, their material wealth bit by bit. You got a broken mouse. Yeah. Fingerprints, but not blood. So as long as they were wearing gloves, they're fine. Like, and all the DNA in their hair and stuff would be dead, so you wouldn't be able to trace it. Don't even think they'd have to spit, would they? Well, it's a spit that would turn people, so it wouldn't be normal spit. Like you, you couldn't, you couldn't forensically analyze vampire nut either. I think that vampires would be firing blanks. Yeah, you might as well, or you could just burn them off. It's like not in the sun, of course, but like you know, just get a hot skillet real quick to fry that thing up and. Yeah, but um, I heard that if you were to actually burn off your entire fingerprint, like your entire entire fingerprint. Yeah. That would actually be very hard to like kind of grip things with your fingers. Like, it would be hard to like kind of do this, you know, like just actually like hold on. <laughs> so I'm surprised it would you're having this combo with a mustard fetishist. You're, you're known <laughs> as the mustard fe fetishist now, babes. Oh my gosh. You've done it to yourself. I know. But I'm helping you promote your channel. I'm the queen of the mustard. <laughs> <laughs> it's what gets her off! Don't ask how the bedroom works. But yeah, we have empty mustard bottles all over the place. I have a body pillow with a fucking bottle of mustard on it. How did I, how did I miss this? How did I miss this booze? Oh, there's booze on the table. I'm a failure. I'm a failure as a booze thief. Alright. I'm going to have to go through the rest of, of the Jarl's Keep real quick and take the rest of his booze. Uh, ready for an enemy attack? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to make you wait a little bit. I'm stealing booze! I just realized, it's like I missed a few bottles. I think they actually respawn? Because I could have sworn that I stolen this stuff before. In fact, I know that I took this booze before. And, like, I think that, uh, like, vampires have high regener regenerative abilities. So, like, even if he did fry off his fingertips, like, they would, it would reform pretty quickly. Oh, I didn't think about that. Yeah. So there would kind of literally be no <laughs> point in doing it. You uh, just gotta go back and disappear yeah. off to the night. Yeah, I'll try not to make you wait too long here, a broken mouse. 
Like, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna start killing stuff again, but first, I need to fill my alcoholic obligations. Look, here's enormous kegs right here. I wish I could use this keg. I wish that was a storage thing. That's gonna dump this bowl here. Give me the booze. Fuck this bowl. Ah, uh, damn it, I didn't want to sit. Young adult going to parties and older vampires being teachers and government employees. Yeah. Like, I think Blade gave the best depiction of what vampires would be doing if they were in the modern era. Oh my god, the Blade trilogy was gold. Third movie... Uh, like, I, I was defensive of that one for a little bit, but I, Ryan Reynolds was a, was a poor choice as being a su supportive character in that position. I was sticking by that. I don't think Ryan Reynolds was good for that Blade movie. But some people have a gallon jug of anal lube in a closet. <laughs> <laughs> the French is on tech. Oh, not French, it's man's Dijon. French is, yeah. French is his basic shit, bro. Yeah, right. Fresh ground. Shit, fresh ground honey mustard. <laughs> <laughs> we make our own. Exactly. It's just some pepper and a dash of barbecue sauce. We gotta. No, Lots we just of honey. Grind our own mustard seeds, too. I'm surprised I didn't get caught for opening that lock. The door was closed. Gotta remember where I is, I'm not in a dungeon. Blood bank worker. But that's, again, that's too obvious. You know, if blood bottles disappeared and shit, like, wouldn't you check the blood, uh, wouldn't you check the worker first? Setting up things as a bane of my existence. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, mine too, broken mouses. Like, especially if I'm in a hurry and I'm just clicking everything on the table. And then I have to go through the 15 second animation, like, God damn it, I'm in a hurry, man. A vampire artist? No, a vampire like nowadays. Like it would actually be a lot easier and harder simultaneously. Like, like I think I can comprehend which ways it would be harder, but like, which ways do you think it'd be easier? Oh, it's really easy to lie nowadays. <laughs> Spending money to use the good stuff. Like, man. Yeah. Like, you, you have yeah. to splurge. All right. You, you don't just use any old shit. There are certain things you have to splurge on. Okay, those things are your hair. Like, if you don't, then you're looking at a chapped asshole, son. Your, your skin care and your anal lube, okay? Right. <laughs> like, your you want hemorrhoids? Because cheap anal lube is how you get hemorrhoids. There <laughs> are <laughs> the common to see blood bank workers. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of I fair. A, they don't maybe. require any type of education, really. They just require, like, a, like a semester program. Yeah, just a non-disclosure agreement. Yeah, and even then, like, they get trained on the job. So they don't even require that. They don't really have to, though. You just gotta know how to stick it with a needle. Yeah. You're not gonna under... No, <laughs> you'd be surprised. <laughs> like, the government, you know... You and I have worked for the government, man. You know, they keep track of the stupidest small shit. It's, it's the small guys that you can screw the hardest. The big guys get away with things. And it had to have been a big guy to lose a bomb, bro. Like, that colonel put in some work over time. He was kissing a lot of ass. Hold on, did I go through? Yep, this is the wrong door. I gotta go back in. I gotta steal all the booze, man. That's the goal. Give me that. I might actually have to stop at home real quick before I keep going on my adventure here. I do booze hand. I need all of the booze. All of it. All of it's coming with me. It's because I don't want to drink that much anymore. <laughs> and you are an angel for that. Just letting you know. Vampires can't be party bros. What do you mean? Oh, uh, yeah, because yeah. vampires can't have their pictures taken. That's very true. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah. Otherwise, but you have to fake their own suicide. You can be a party years. bro and not like your picture being taken a lot. People we know we know a couple of guys like that, like Murder Mike, for example. Not my not my roommate, different Mike. I know a lot of Mikes. They all have different nicknames. Taking a shit, <laughs> the pic was taken. Sometimes I like, <laughs> might just sneak up on them and take a picture on them anyway, though. Yeah, sometimes it happens. It's like, oh, oh, you can't see my face. I can't make facial expressions now. Fuck. 
Man, I, I know not a bunch enough of mics. Ikes, though. Not enough Ikes. Got like four mics, but no Ikes. Yeah. A very lopsided mic to Ike ratio. Exactly. <laughs> Just claim they were taking a shit. I'm still laughing about that. <laughs> <laughs> Gee, Frank has been to be shitty a lot, like all the time. Like every time we try to take a picture, he's just shits. Can't imagine why that's happening. Frank, do you have a colon problem? Hemorrhoids! Ah! <laughs> 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 oh, gee, Frank, the video is crazy far behind. You want to try it? You want to try it again? No, that's yeah. no, okay. That's one thing I've noticed, is like, there's a six, seven second lag behind uh, real time and uh, when the video is actually uploaded to Twitch, if that's what you're referring to. <laughs> it's, like, it's a bit of a problem if I'm trying to show the screen, because, like, the reverb could just echo us off of each other, it gets kind of crazy. <laughs> but that might also be a Streamlabs OBS problem. Healthy colon, bro. Hell yeah, dude. Five Metamucil pills when you wake up. Five. No less than five. And fish oil. That's lubricant for the insides. My body processes weight, waste at an appropriate level. Come at me, bitch. <laughs> don't forget your probiotics. Especially if you don't get enough vegetables. That's how you get she healthy stool. That's how you get she big meaty healthy stool. Can I take this? No, but I'm gonna steal it. Fuck you, Farngar. Uh, oh, for the plastic, for the, um, from that way, again, Dan Clotus, because of aging thing, you can always live in LA because they might actually, like, get a shit ton of plastic surgery, so they might just think you're getting plastic surgery all the time. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, or you're in one of those hyperbaric oxygen chambers. Like, I don't know if you guys heard about that, but, like, it's, it's legit. It's like, uh, I've, I've been getting a couple of news stories on my Google page about that lately. It's like, apparently, like, this team of scientists took a group of individuals who were 65, and they had them sit in a hyperbaric uh, oxygen chamber for uh, an average of three months for 40 minutes at a time. <laughs> no, it was 40 days, and they had them in there for three hours each day. And their telomeres actually lengthened. Which it just is insane. Like, it, it's a it's a proven scientific method to like reverse aging. Like the aver like the first immortal on Earth might already be alive, guys. Do <laughs> the motor oil thing. <laughs> drink a pint. Oh, you drink only a shot? No, a whole pint. A whole pint, dude. Like you're gonna freeze up if you don't get enough. Or maybe it's me with the leaky asshole. I don't know. Maybe it's my asshole that just has a leak. Dude, isn't that some insane shit? It's got me hopeful. Not again, not so much, because it's only gonna, like, even if it's cheap to reproduce, only the richest assholes are gonna be able to do that. I just have to drop all this booze off. Holy crap, I wanna have a pen shirt! I wanna have a pen shirt so I can, like, we get off some motherfuckers in my mouth. We can live long enough to become lobsters. Yeah, everyone. Well, it does grow larger. Bro, that means I could lift heavy forever. I never have to slow down. My joints will rematerialize. Re they won't. They'll stop crunching. Yeah, dude. Yeah. That's where they come in for look at that. Over three hundred bottles of booze so far, but that's nowhere near enough. We need way more booze. I also want a pincher too, so that way I could like crush steel. We are crabs. Yes, we're crabs. And we pinch your nuts! Sorry, I'm just remembering Dave Chappelle. This <laughs> is like the Chappelle show. Oh, shit. Like, you know, some edgy fuck, though, is gonna call themselves a vampire and bathe in the blood of virgins and shit. It's like, yes, this is helping me live forever. Oh. Larry Lobster. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, man. Yes. Dude, heavy. gains forever. Gains until I die, man. Never have to stop. It's actually a bit of a dream, bro. Like, I miss benching heavy. 
but I told I tore my rotator cuff. So like the flexibility in my right shoulder is just shot. It's like and I can't properly retract. I, I can't supinate my shoulders properly anymore. It sucks. Like, maybe that, that would help me, like, rejuvenate if I can get into one of those hyperbaric chambers. I don't know. I'm just fantasizing now. Yeah. If you live forever, then you're just existing. <laughs> That's what happened in the 70s. Right? With Arnold and the boys. Uh, I need to get rid of a few of these pickaxes. Let me just take an objective look at this inventory real quick. So I gotta get rid of this, the, the studded armor. Uh, okay, I know what I have to get rid of now. I'm gonna stop coming into the keep now. I know I don't have anything else for me in the keep. The keep is empty. I took all the booze. Lady A, you can chill there, boozeless. You need to stop drinking anyway, girl. I've seen you over there. You party too hard. Hold on a second. Let me actually pause and bring up that link you just pushed there, Sour Patch. I just want to see this is real quick. Yeah, I have to go to Task Manager every time. So it's Marcus Wesson. Nine counts of first degree murder and 14 sex crimes. Oh. oh my and gosh. his daughters. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh. Bro, why? <laughs> why the? That's. Oh, the vampire killing people to bathe them blind. <laughs> this guy first. Nah, dude, you, you can't use the asshole. This has to be pure virgins. Only the blood of innocent virgins will keep you young. I can probably believe the bathroom and shit. I don't know. Oh, okay, we'll doubt that and that guy who you were just looking at. I mean, I, I was reading some of it. Like, he was like literally te teaching his children that he's God or whatever. That's Ugh. just scary. Yeah, fuck that guy. <laughs> I, I, I think we can all agree, fuck that guy, man. Holy shit. He said he was a vampire, really? Oh, I didn't read Lara far enough, I think. Ah, oh, dude, that's creepy. But now you got me thinking of Ron Jeremy. Like, like you heard, have you heard that uh, Ron Jeremy is looking at like 311 years in prison or something like that? Oh, hey, National, National cookie, cookie Day? Yeah, we gotta eat all the cookies. Dude, we have to get some cookies tomorrow. Yeah, we'll see a whole bunch of cookies. Like, I'll take any excuse to eat cookies. Uh, like I'm a sucker for Oreo, Oreos. Just trying, trying to get it away from from the rape. <laughs> Just trying to get it away from the rape, man. <laughs> it's, it's shocking myself. Well, then I gotta get rid of horn helmet. I get rid of that shit. And uh, let's see, what else can I give you? What else? Oh, what's up, Louie? You guys can't see this dude right here. He's got, he's getting attention. But, yeah. Dude, yeah, right? Like, I keep getting pumped, like, these bakeless three-item recipes, too. It's like, man, I don't see the point in that. I would bake my cookies. Yeah, an offshoot of Homo sapiens found in Italy? Eating people in the 1700s. Yeah, I'll believe anything at this point. <laughs> it's like, uh, if you're looking for a really cool cannibal story, Green Inferno. Like, I think Green Green Inferno was loosely based off of real events. But, uh... Well, you, 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 like, you can probably already infer that it's about cannibals. <laughs> it, it's some of the sickest shit you'll find, man. I, I strongly recommend it. It should be on Netflix right now if you got the time. But what was this offshoot of, uh... Homo Sapiens? Like, uh... Like, I, th I think I've heard of a group of people that were found in the cave. Yeah, I remember you giving me that recipe a couple of months ago. I'm sorry, I've never, like, taken the time to actually attempt it. I have all of those ingredients here. 
One cup of sugar, one cup of peanut butter, and one egg in an oven for 450 degrees. Oh, if you guys want to hear a lot of another really cool cannibal story, there's also Cannibal Island, which was actually a prison. Cannibal Island? Yeah, it was like a gulag. The gulag? 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 Yeah. Which one is it? Like, I it's think, yeah, if you're looking for a good horror movie, it's fun. A little sick, but fun. How does this lady have so much money? Did I give her a bunch of money without thinking about it? Yeah, the Cannibal Island people. Oh, are you talking about, like, off of Grana uh, Granada? I think is the name of the island. Granada? Yeah, I think I heard of that, too. Where did you find it? I just shook. I was just searching um, Homo Sabian offshoot that ate people. Ooh, man. Isn't quite human, yeah. Damn, it just it's... makes... Like... That's fascinating shit. Like, it makes... That just made me think... About, uh, like... Sherpas in the Himalayas, right? Like, they've evolved over the last 2,000 years or so to have, like, an increased uh, VO2 capacity. And, uh, they actually have lungs that are capable of, uh, like, more efficiently drawing in oxygen for th from, uh, thinner atmospheres. The maze awaits. Don't lose yourself in the maze, Broken Mouse. Stay sane. Don't let yourself go crazy, bro. I hope you find a good light source. But we like you, man. We don't want you to lose yourself in there. I think I want to take a shower now. Oh, you tested negative for COVID? Dude, that that's great, good. Sammy. I'm really glad to hear that. This shit's one of the first diseases that can pass the blood-brain barrier. So it can actually cause neurological damage. So I'm really happy that you haven't caught it. And yeah, like, if you want to hop on a Discord uh, pretty quick here, uh, the lady friend is going off to take her shower now. But it was fun having you with us. Thank you. Yeah, baby. Yeah. I'll see you later with the honey mustard, baby. Oh, we'll bust out the Dijon. Is Dijon a honey mustard? I should know this. <laughs> yeah, the Inuits. Yeah, like, and you would think, like, with the lack of uh, nutritional diversity, that, uh, like, the Inuits wouldn't be, like, that they'd be dying in their 30s from, like, heart attacks or some shit. But, uh, like, they're a very, very old uh, people. Like, not just physically themselves individually, but like as a collective. Hell yeah, man. It's always fun having her down here hanging out with me. But it's like she's just been working so hard on her homework lately. Like, she has a bunch of essays coming up, and she has this final project due that she's working, like a PDF type of deal. Uh, it's made spending time together pretty hard, too, because, like, we both use the same office space. Like, she'll use the office space in the mornings and afternoons for her homework and her schoolwork in general. And then I, I use it, you know, for streaming in the evenings. So uh, we, we only have, like, a couple of hours to spend together every day. So it would be nice if she were able to hang out with us even more often. Genuinely like having her around, man. It's the reason why I date her. It's more than just honey mustard. Oh, the honey mustard helps. Oh, oh, fuck. Dog, why? Why dog attack? No, I didn't mean... No, you made me kill the dog? Oh, now you're dead. These sick bastards. Sick the dog on me. Oh, Barbus, I miss you, boy. Why, Barbus? Why were you a narc snitching, bitch? Damn it! Hold on a second, man. 
Alright. Okay, give me one second here, Sour Patch. I want to actually hop on Discord if you got the time for that. Like, you should probably have access to our general uh, chat, right? If we go into the voice channels, general here, I'm on right now. I think I am? Yeah, it says I'm voice connected. So, like, you can take your time hopping onto that. Like, I'm wondering if anybody that's on our channel at the moment could hear my voice. That'd be kind of weird. It's like, even if they're not streaming with us right now, it's like, they get that echo effect. You're probably going to have to mute uh, the audio for the stream, too. Well, <laughs> just because, well, you know, that six, seven second delay that I was talking about, there's going to be quite a reverb. Uh, no, I've got everything. I've got everything pretty much set up over here, man. How's it going? Oh yeah, you're still working on your run, dude. What level are you? Dude, it sounds brutal. Like you just have to sit there and let your companions do all the work. Yeah, it looks like Sammy Hammy can't hear you. It looks like uh, your audio isn't coming up. So let me just tweak that. I need to get uh, on to uh, stream OBS real quick. I'll just bring this up so I can show you guys what I'm doing. It's going to be a little bit of a like uh, inception effect over here. But uh, just bear with me a second. If I bring up this panel so I can see. And I don't think I'm going to be able to solve the webcam issue either, guys. But uh, hang with me just a second. Uh, let's go. It's going to be an audio input capture. I think, yeah, it's audio input capture. Uh, that's an existing source. Uh, okay. Yeah. I know. <laughs> yeah, I think there's like a, a 20 second buffer on this stream right now. So it might be actually 20 seconds that you see. Yeah, okay, so if it's not in a separate uh, audio capture, then it's going to be a browser source? Or is it going to be in a scene source? Or do I just have to authorize... Yeah, streamer mode is enabled for Discord. Okay, so it's still an ad source. So I think it would be... No, it can't be browser source, could it? Bro. Yeah, like, this is the audio in. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, shit. Yeah, I still... Okay. So if I do audio output default, I have to expand this so I can see. Uh... Right, there's a delay. I'm already there. <laughs> oh, it's like it's, 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 get the fucking castle of this. Like, there it's there. It's done. <laughs> no, man, I'm not seeing it. I'm leaving this up long enough. So hopefully, it's like uh, I'm 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 only getting my output options here. Yeah. And this has got to be really annoying for Sammy Hammy and everybody else that's watching right now. Like, I have got to figure this shit out. Okay, so it's not display cap game output video capture. Narrowing it down, we know what it's not. That helps. <laughs> Is it browser source? Uh, please enter the name of the source. So if I try and input Discord. Uh, URL streamlabs.com browser source. Um, hmm. No, I don't think it's this issue. Yeah. We're absolutely going to have to connect to that Discord again. But. 
Right, but that's be like I had to dump my catch. I, I uh, reset my catch, and uh, yeah, it uh, reset all my settings to Streamlabs OBS. So I actually had to set this up again uh, earlier today, which is why you can't see my uh, face. <laughs> like it's why it only pops up momentarily now and then. And even my target bitrate's been lowered to, to 2930, and it's been locked in. Like I used to have my bitrate closer to 4000. Desktop audio device. Yeah, yeah. So uh, it's uh, auxiliary device, desktop channels, simple right. Okay, that's not it. This ain't any of that shit. Let's go for output stream general. Like stream itself, uh, add destination. No, that's not add destination. This would be an add input. So it would be configure default devices, OBS import. Output, no, it'd be input, right? So general is controlling output. So if like I think output is re regarding how like stream OBS outputs for its upload. Yeah. So keep recording with stream stops automatically recording with streaming. No, this is all has to do with recording show confirmation dialog. No, this is all about opening up Streamlabs OBS. So if it all right. Oh. Okay, so if I go into... Gotcha, so... Alright, so, like, uh, what settings would that be exactly so we can make this go more quickly? If I were to open up, it would be... Alright. A minute. Do I... Yeah, would it be in uh, probably server settings, right? Or would I put it into something else? <laughs> server settings. Yeah, here's the overview right here. And then invites on... Uh, in, in, in integrations, possibly. Or is it an auto log? Webhook? No, it's not channels followed either. Uh, enable community. Yeah, we're, we're figuring this out, guys. Thank you so much for being patient, everybody that's hanging with us in the stream right now. Yep, voice chat. Okay. So if I go in right here into the general. Alright, settings, edit channel, permissions. Then probably manage channel members for these permission man permissions to manage webhooks. Uh view channel. Can I hmm. No, this is just involving like permissions for the individuals in our chat. Okay, so is it overview or is it uh Right. Yeah. Yeah, it says edit channel on the right next to invite. I have overview, permissions, and invites. Yeah, man. Uh. <laughs> Shit, dude. Oh, man. Yeah, it's on my job. Like I, I set this up months ago, <laughs> so I'm, I'm relearning everything. No, no, it's my bad, man. Like I, I need to figure this shit out. I, I should have had my ducks in a row before I began this, and I don't. Like my ducks are scattered. They're all over the place, man. They're shitting in the yard. Ah, uh, like this is the usual stream. <laughs> This is my usual performance, I'm afraid. Alright, manage permissions is, um... No, it's not that. This is just adjusting which permissions certain people have here. So if it's connect, voice permissions, what's that do? Uh, what's connect do? Okay, like, maybe if I hit that panel here? Or use voice activity, like... Hold on a second, no, just save channel. Sync now. Voice channels. Permissions not synced with the category. Sync permissions. Yeah. 
All right. Okay, so is that audio input or audio output? So, like, it's probably in the main settings. Audio, desktop, audio one default. Alright, let's capture as desktop audio device one. This would be the E40DO. Uh, give it a few talks right now. Can anybody who's uh, in on the stream hear uh, Sour Patch now? Like, I think, I think that you're being captured now. I don't want to say for sure. Uh, desktop audio device two is disabled. So let's switch that uh, to our E40DO uh, setting as well. Uh, auxiliary device capturing is microphone. <sighs> yeah, and I have Discord set up on the e on uh, the larger the two screens on on the same screen as uh, we're running Skyrim on, so it should be able to. They they should be able to hear you know thing. Yeah. All right, I'm looking at the settings of uh, okay. So I'm not picking up anything on. Where's that? Oh, look at that. Dope. All right. But it's already cranked up all the way. Yeah. Yeah, is it just like not linked up correctly? Let's see here. Okay, stream audio to the right about uh, properties. Okay, stream on browser source. Um, control. Control audio via OBS. Damn. Nah, we're not getting this. What the f- I'll just take it back to the chat for now and I'll figure this out on my own. Alright, that would probably be for the best. Everybody who was hanging with us is already <laughs> looking at it. I'm sorry, bro. We'll get this figured out. Peace, man. Uh, shit. <sighs> Hold on a second, I gotta rearrange the chords here. All my cords are getting tangled and my cat's attacking them. Oh, I don't even have my fan angled correctly. I think my computer is running. It's just a little bit hot. Okay, I have to be careful. Got to get this fan angled a bit better here. There we go. Make sure it's just... All right, sorry about that, guys. That was our failed attempt to troubleshoot this. We almost had it. Like, we're on the right track. I think that it is something that I have to arrange through uh, the OBS here. Like, I could probably look up a tutorial when I'm over with this. I believe that there was a specific tutorial that I was using in order to find the information beforehand. But for now, we're just going to continue on with the game. Uh, who just messaged? Anybody that uh, does? Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Right. Okay. All right. Going on with the mission. We got a lot of booze to raid. We got a lot of places to take, gases to kick, names to say. I think it's like that. Names to kick and asses to take. I think that's the right expression. Yep. Hats on, but oh shit, now there's something in the. Ah! Looks like I have to rearrange a little bit more. In my Streamlabs tab, we'll just move that way out of the way over there. How's that? Okay, now everybody can see. I'm just going to take a look at the channel real quick. Okay, that's been moved out of the way. I'm so sorry about that. Damn, <laughs> it is like a 20 second delay. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, and one more time, because I had the Twitch overlay up and not the Stream OBS. Twitch overlay doesn't refresh fast enough to allow me to see you guys comment. Real pain in the dick. 
Yeah, don't worry about it, man. Well, I'll get this figured out. I just have to allocate more time to it. This is something I'm just gonna handle. Like, I'd like to say that I'm gonna do it after the stream, but that'd be me lying to myself. I'm usually just completely fried after this. It's something about the social interaction that comes with streaming. It's like, that's why a services position is exhausting, because it requires a large amount of mental energy in order to, like, balance, like, various interactions and uh, relationships. Because as part of our species evolution is to manage relationships, like, we devote certain, like, like physical portions of our mind and the amount of energy we uh, that we expend on those portions. I'm rambling a little bit. But yeah, this, this kind of wears me out. <laughs> so, like, I think I'm going to have a lot of opportunity to work on the OBS during the weekend, which is why I'm saying I'm probably not going to have the OBS set up until Monday. Obviously, that's not going to be uh, good enough for our game day on Saturday. But I do think that it'll only take uh, a, a small tutorial. Oh, I just got my ass kicked. I think it'll only take a small tutorial in order for me to refigure out how to connect Discord properly. Like, I'm, I'm, my mind's flashing towards a 15 minute video. Oh wow, I spawned far away from that. And Rhetoric's Retreat, if I remember correctly, is where I'm going to get a sword for, uh... Like, I can't remember the dude's name. But, uh, yeah, that was the end of the chamber there. And it's this guy's sword right here, so I might as well just start his quest. Amran's gonna ask me to retrieve his family sword. But, uh, just wanna touch on that. Like, I don't want to waste, uh, any more of you guys' time, uh, <clears throat> with me troubleshooting. <laughs> when, like, I should be devoting my attention to you guys and to the game itself. I always feel bad when I have to bring up something or I have to or, uh, like, I have to deal with the settings for this disc, for, uh, this, uh, stream while I'm in the middle of running it. But yeah, with that, we're gonna get the show back on the road. <laughs> okay, so, we're gonna go back to Red Aaron's Retreat. That band of chief is gonna be a little bit of an issue, but as soon as I get him to aggro Fendal, it should be fine. This axe is pretty much worthless at this point. I, I'm not gonna bother to recharge uh, its uh, fire enchantment. Like uh, the Dawnbreaker is gonna be enough of that. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna equip Elven Sword, and that way for my perk here, I have a level up. I'm probably gonna invest that level up into Critical Chance for Swords and One-Handed. But I want to save that for the encounter with the Bandit Chief. So we were talking about, what do you think a vampire would be in modern time, in the modern era? And I've heard professor, history professor specifically, Weeb was my suggestion, uh, blood bank worker, or government official for the younger generations, or rich aristocrat selling his material possessions occasionally to continue to, to eke out a, like a casual lifestyle. Does anybody else have any ideas? Like, if a vampire were to be among us in the modern era, what job do you think they'd have? Like, personally, <clears throat> I'm still leaning towards weeb. Like, but, uh, like, possibly, like, a more socially capable version of Weeb, like, an anime convention nerd. Like, a cosplayer. Or a furry. A cosplayer or a furry would be perfect. They could always wear a mask, hide, have makeup to disguise themselves. They'd just be traveling amongst... <clears throat> they'd be traveling amongst their convention goers slowly converting the main cast infecting but infecting popular celebrities authors directors artists 
like if vampires are among us, then they write anime, bruh, guys. They author and write manga. And I hope that's the case. Because, damn it, I want to see the end of Hajime no Ippo. <laughs> this motherfucker's already wrote like 1,300 chapters. And Ippo is still retired. Like, come on, man. If there's anybody that I want to be an immortal vampire, it's, uh, it's the author of Hajime no Ippo. <laughs> also, Kira, uh, uh, God, I forgot, I'm forgetting author's name, left and right. Uh, Kentaro Miro, author of Berserk. He's another one that I wouldn't want to be an immortal vampire. Otherwise, we're never gonna get, get an end to this story, bro. Like, he's releasing chapters once a month now. For like half a year, and then he takes another year, half year off hiatus. Yeah. Exactly. See, you get it, Sour Patch. I'm saying, like, people who are wearing the masks, like the furry costumes, those are perfect disguises. Or they could be like modern werewolves. It's not a costume. And those are just his eyes. They always look rapey. <laughs> oh, man. It's how he feels inside. Oh, dude. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't stop taking the mick out of these guys. It's just a funny predicament. Uh, and real quick... Uh, babes, I'm sorry, but, uh, we couldn't get Discord audio to function for the stream. Yeah, so we're gonna have to save that conversation for the multiplayer day. And if you're a part of our Discord and you haven't got the chance to already, please go ahead and check out the polling tab. Uh, we have our poll up for, uh, like, you're gonna be able to vote between either Counter-Strike Global Offensive or Among Us, and you'll get to vote on what hours you'll have available to play. And I got distracted right there, and I just got my shit pushed in. <laughs> it's like, always, always, after I've died in an area, I start quick saving in, like, every room, so I haven't lost too much progress this time around. You know, small blessings, but I, I, I'm still taking this like a punk. Who am I to be making fun of anyone right now? <laughs> and I'm just... Like, I'm getting reamed casually by banded outlaws. Oh, the shame. The iniquity. The indignity. Alright, I gotta give Fendal a chance to get out of here. Oh, here's the chief. Yeah, this is the only way I'm gonna be able to move forward. This is why we have all the soup for, damn it. Oh, 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 god. Wow, with a dagger. He bashed my face and then he gave me <laughs> like a cut for good measure. Alright, I'm gonna have to approach this a little bit differently. This isn't near the same situation that we had with Meridius Beacon. I'm gonna have to funnel them through this tunnel, I think. I'm gonna take the vegetable soup prematurely. Don't you dare. If I can just take out that outlaw first. Yeah, Fendal's already got to the Bandit Chief occupied. And there we go, the Outlaw's down, if I can circle around him. Yeah, he's already got Fendal down pretty low here. But I should be able to take him out now. Yeah, I've already got him stunlocked. Perfect. God, Vegetable Soup is so fucking overpowered. I've said that every time I play in Skyrim. And every time I mean it 100%. This is a really overpowered item, man. Cooking is so underrated in Skyrim. There we go. And he's dead. I don't know if I want to collect that. Let's see what other loot they got, because I am I might have to go straight back to a white run to unload my shit real quick. Depending on what we find here. Last seed. Nice. Sneak. Okay. I need sneak. I need all that that I can get. Oh, what the heck? Oh my god. She just started a really loud video over there, and it startled me. I jump easy. Don't do that to me. Ah! Uh, let's 
six trillion years. Alrighty. Ooh, glass sword. Now I ooh, and a treasure map too. Don't play it too loud, please. Thank you, because remember this microphone is really sensitive. Screw a mouse farting, you could hear a fly fart on this thing. Yeah, in fact, your cat headphones are on that are on that chair right there, along with uh, the uh, double-ended mini jack plug, babes. Please. Okay. Thank you. Whew, okay, but I think with that, I'm gonna toss this sword here. It's stolen, and I don't have the thief skill unlocked yet, and I don't really want to go over there and do all that just to sell an Melvin sword. So I'm gonna spec that, unspec axe white run. Oh yeah, man. I like saving my level ups for when I get into bot when I go into battle. Like if that bandit chief had hit me during that fight, I was gonna use a level up, for example. But otherwise I hold off on using these things. Especially when I know that I'm going around clearing out dungeons. And that a few of these uh, also have bandit chiefs, and I, you know. Well, you, you saw that that guy kill cammed me when I had over half my health left. <laughs> That's just the kind of fights I'm going to be in. Yeah, dude. But I already know what I'm going to spend that perk on. Critical hit swords. But this glass sword is a nice upgrade, man. It's even better than that stolen elven sword I just took. I feel I, I feel kind of bad. I did Balgriff dirty. No, it wasn't even the dagger that he killed me with, bro. He got me with the shield. He bashed my face in. <laughs> he power bashed me to death. He pow he kill cam power bashed me. And I must yeah. I must have had like 100 health left, because my max health right now is 170. Oh my god, I'm gonna need at least 300 health before I can start safely encountering most of these opponents, and even then, like a Briarheart that's dual wielding will be able to one hit me. And uh, like, I think that in Legendary, like enemy NPCs uh, double their uh, damage outputs overall. Which is why I'm holding off on doing that uh, drinking mission with Sam. Because I don't want to encounter... <laughs> That's why I'm also holding off on companions, because... Those Hagravens... Are going to be really brutal to fight at my low level. I have to be able to attack at least one hit. And I have to have a few health potions stocked up for that moment. Or at least have the magic and the restoration points... Uh, to use closed wounds... If I can dual wield to close wounds, uh, then I'll, that that's pretty much it for uh, everything I'll need to take on bosses like that. I'll even be able to go back to the Black Star. But I think because I haven't loaded uh, the level that has the Dremoras in it yet, that all those Dremoras are going to have a uh, fireball next time I try and challenge it. So that's really just going to be a matter of stocking up on the right uh, potions. This is where I'm going to use the level up. <laughs> yeah, let's go for 180. Yeah, I'm going to need uh, some a really good fire resistance potion. I'm going to need a few of those. It's going to take me more than 60 seconds to get through that. Uh, I'm going to need resist magic too, although I don't think resist magic is going to do anything against the fire damage. It might do a little bit. Let's see, critical charge. Hmm... I'm not going to need either of these. Uh, Bladesman. That's what I want. And I should have uh, vegetable, ju vegetable soups effect still active. Yep. Still a fast recharge. Oh boy. Fendal. Fendal. Oh boy. Soundtrack. <laughs> Thanks, Black Kitty. I'll get to that in a moment. Uh, I'm, I need to heal.
Maybe I should have invested into standing strike after all. Okay, time to run. <laughs> it's time to run. Time to get my bearings. Oh boy, they're shooting me. <laughs> Where'd you see that pop up? The mashups? After I'm done getting my butt kicked. I'll take a look at that. Alright, even the wolves. Oh man, I bet Fendal's dead. Either that or he's down right now. I know that he's not an essential NPC. Yeah, he's starting to lose it. Well, I've got the opportunity. Got to use healing hands on... Oh, I don't have healing Oh, and why don't I have healing hands? Discord? Yeah, hold up. Oh, you guys are going to be on. That's cool. All right. Hold on a second. I don't have heal other in my inventory. That's bad. But Fendal just got an automatic rejuvenation. That's good. And there's only outlaws left, but they're shooting me a lot. That's bad. <laughs> and the cat... No, Kinsey. Babes, can cats have barbecue sauce? I know they're going to have pork. Can they have barbecue sauce? No, Kinsey, get down. <laughs> Gotta move the plate out of the way. Oh, man. Okay, that's another one down. Holy shit, I'm so surprised that I'm alive right now. <laughs> okay, that's Fendal. Regular ass bandit. Okay, we're good. Regular old ass bandit. Another one down. Bit the dust. Only one left. I can breathe a little bit. Don't want to let all the tension out yet, though. Yeah, he hits hard. And someone else is in here shooting me. It's that guy. Bandit thug. Gonna take the guy out on top of the wall. Don't think he's a thug. Regular bandit. Alright, Fendal's right there. Oh, are you kidding? So those barricades do work. Apparently. What the fuck, Fendal? I gotta do everything for you, bro. Why was that barrier enough to stop you? Oh, is she showing you the, uh... She, she's showing you the smog and, uh, Ornstein plus the, uh, the... Yeah, the smog-Ornstein mashup. I forgot the other half of it already. Words fail me when I'm concentrating like this, man. I think I could actually play that without getting copyright struck on the channel. Oh, the Black Eyed Peas and Mozart? <laughs> Dude, that one's great. You also gotta get her to show you the Orange Team Smog plus Space Jam matchup. Space Jam is the one I was forgetting. Not with the dagger. Not today! Oh. Give me a wine. <laughs> On this. <laughs> She's definitely going to, I think. That's one of her favorites. Do you two better? Oh boy. First half done. Time to clear the castle. I'm surprised that NPCs don't come pouring out of a fort if you're attacking it. Like, you actually have to go into the fort. 
It's in immersive. It's like all my homies are getting slaughtered out there. But that's okay. I'll wait my turn. Game audio is extremely low. Here, let me give that. Check. It's pretty loud on my end, but let's see if I can fix that output. I want to adjust that in the Discord real quick. Audio input capture, audio output capture, micro unit. Yeah, okay. All right, I have that turned up on the way here. Uh, hold on a second. Hmm. Damn. I might have to. Here's how it says. It might be being mute a little bit. Hold on a second. Let me bring up settings one more time. Output. It's not letting me access anything regarding output mode right now. Uh, audio. Audio device. Yep, no. Okay, save all right. Stream. In general, no. Hmm. I think that has to do okay how about I turn down the uh, microphone capture if I turn down the microphone capture a little bit like that and then through game here gameplay uh, it would be through audio yeah, I have everything cranked up in the game. <laughs> I'm so sorry about that, man. No, I need to know these issues. I need to be hearing the feedback as I go. Because the last thing I want to be is... is uh, like, again, it's about the service I provide and the quality of the service itself. Can you still hear me good? Like, is this a good compromise that uh, if I turn down my microphone, you can turn up the audio and hear everything a little bit better? A lot of booze here, though. It makes me happy. Bandits know how to live. Still nothing from the game, you're saying. So you can't hear the game at all. Like, not even when I use the restoration, not even when I'm using... Like, when I'm attacking? Yeah, he got hit by his own trap. I'm gonna die. Oh boy. Nothing at all from the game. That's no bueno, amigo. Were you able to hear anything beforehand? Were you able to hear the game before we started uh, tinkering with the stream settings? I'm not sure how I died just now. Did Fendal betray me? Louie. What's up, dude? Okay, that's... Man, it's no problem at all. I'll fix that right now. At least I remember what we did so I can actually fix it. Okay, so if I bring up settings, go to audio... Audio, that was disabled for uh, desktop audio 2, and then I had a default desktop audio device 1. Okay. If I have that up, then we're going to give this a small test with Space Jam. Here's four tips to check your cat's at its best. Man, I can't even hear it. Size. Look fine, Fiat. 
this one always has Yeah, I'm not yeah. hearing anything at all. Well, there's nothing wrong with her, is there? Perfect size. It's chicky kids. What the hell is this? Okay, I'm gonna turn that off and start torching you guys. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Okay, so I'm gonna reopen. Audio. Default. Back to E40. Let's go with default for this one. Still nothing on my end. Requires a restart. Oh my god. You heard it? Alright, is it echoing this time? Because I still can't hear this. I have it cranked all the way up and it's not going through my headset. <laughs> I'm gonna assume by your response that it's still like really crazy. What the fuck is going on, man? Alright, headset, microphone, wireless controller, okay. So, no, the input devices should be coming through the microphone, Yeti stereo microphone, okay, so the choose output should be coming through. has no problems going through that right now. Yeah, I didn't either when I first started. Audio output capture. Audio output should be going through E40. Yeah. Or maybe one of their friends kind of like held their hand while they were doing it. Still nothing on my side. <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Like I'm, I'm kind of hoping that you do that sometime, Black Kitty, because it's like I, I'm, I'm sure that if we put our heads together that we can figure this out. Oh my goodness. Okay, so desktop audio is allocated E40, 40 D0. Like, maybe, like, I would put up... <laughs> okay, first of all, I'm sorry, this might be a little bit... No, it's totally fine, bro. I had honestly thought that I'd already had voice chat set up, but I forgot that that was something that I had to specifically do, so... How's this? I am going to change my settings from system sound. Let's have our output be the television itself, and if I play that... Okay, so that's actually coming from the television now. That probably sounds a little crappy. But I don't want to leave it like that. So it might just be... <laughs> okay, so that works. I know my headset works. So if I switch that back to the headset earphone piece... Okay, now I can hear it better. Alright, I had it allocated to the wrong output setting. Okay, I can hear it just fine. Okay, so it sounds fine the way it is right now?
Well, no, you got to remember, Black Kitty, that, uh, like, I had to reset my catch last night. I've been fiddling with and, uh, like, adjusting Streamlabs OBS. I was, uh, trying to get my extensions to work, so I had to reset a few things. And it... Resetting my Chrome browser also reset my Streamlabs uh, OBS client. So, all my old settings are gone, unfortunately. <laughs> So if we got that worked out, and that all sounds fine. Like, it still sounds fine, right? Just want to pause that. So I put up the wrong video for that. I don't want to extend it, though. But that should have been the right one right there. But it, it didn't play. Okay. Alright, sounds good? Alright. So tell me if the game sounds good now. Is that good quality right there? Or are you still hearing a muffle? I'm gonna die. Yeah, I clicked the wrong one. <laughs> Oh, man. Okay. Awesome. Awesome, awesome all the way through. Do I need to turn back up the microphone, or is this a good volume for me? Oh, on, I gotta turn. Alright, all levels good? Awesome. Dope, and let's keep going. Don't touch anything. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry about that, man. I don't want to. If it's good with you guys, it's good with me. I just want to keep going. It's like we're still getting shot at. Did Black Kitty get? Did Black Kitty already leave? No. She got to abandon us, bro. Feel forsaken. Okay. She's still here. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, babes. I just noticed that we dropped another... We dropped another viewer, like... I think that I'm watching myself on my own channel. I have to be, right? Like, that's... I'm so sorry. I'm going to do this one more time. Did it kick me off the browser? Is that what's going on? Okay, closing out on that channel. Yeah, it should be fine. Okay, everything should be fine, bro. Okay. I'm not tweaking. I'm only tweaking a little bit. Just tweaking a little bit. I'm tweaking hard, bro. Oh, I'm tweaking super hard. I didn't even bring back up OPS. God damn it. Troubleshooting has fried my brain. I didn't have much more to begin with. <laughs> yeah, probably, man. Well, I was thinking that a third person was, well, me. <laughs> Trying to give myself that one extra view, you know? So I, I was just wondering, is, like, is, is Twitch messing with me again? Oh, he just killed his bro. Okay, here we go. Alright, alright, we're good. Dialed in. Not gonna die this time. Not gonna die this time, have the audio set up. We're back at the castle. We're gonna steal the booze. That's the mission now. All right, man. Sounds good. Tell me what you learned. Like, it's a genuinely confusing setup, isn't it? Thank God it's not just me. Makes me feel less stupid.
some gardens. All right. Oh, you want to go too? This guy's a big boy. Highwayman. I'm finally encountering highwaymen. If I'm not careful, these guys are really gonna railroad me. And he's gonna kill Fenda. Gotta make quick work of him. Okay. You too. Take poo poo. Ooh, fun kill can. Oh, I can finally breathe a little bit. And quick save. Not gonna have to redo any of that stuff anymore. Okay. Oh, and we're back. We're fully functioning, guys. It's on. Time to raid this bitch. And depending on which quest line I take for the Civil War, this would have been one of the levels. That doesn't matter too much, though. Because after the Civil War, I think it's the Imperials? No, it's the Stormcloaks that move in here. If you're going with the Imperial line, you kill them all. Oh! I gotta kill this lady for the Dark Brotherhood. Why do I think that's bullshit? If that's all you do, lady, then how come you have a Dark Brotherhood contract out for you? I can't even keep track of all the people who have been in out of this fort. They come, they go. This lady is full of shit. She's hiding something. What did you do, Agnes? What'd you do? Seriously, like, why is she the only, like... Why is she attached to this building so much? What'd she do with the former residents? She can't just be some innocent old lady. That, that's almost too good to be true. Okay. Ow. Kill time. I think there's a guy up there. Katy Perry sings the plastic bag line to the rhythm of firework. A witch, maybe. Like, maybe not a witch. Maybe like an alchemist of some kind. Like a poisoner. I thought she's poisoned all the former lower lords of this castle. She must have. That'd be a little bit mundane, wouldn't it? That's the obvious answer. I'm wondering, what did she really do? She fucked somebody. Or she didn't fuck somebody. Who did she not or do fuck? Who did you fuck, Agnes? Veteran? Maybe. Like a combat veteran? Mm, I don't buy it. I don't buy it. She doesn't seem like the fighting type. Here's an Imperial. Tortured the shit out of this guy. And no more booze to be found. And I'm perfectly at 330 carry weight, so I'm gonna get the hell out of here. I got some shit to sell! Don't need the Argonian book. We gotta take off. Oh. Ah, okay. 
back to Whiterun. Oh man, I could hear that crack through the headphones. Oh boy. Got some good looking to protect yourself or deal some damage. Okay. Is my shield stolen? I think my shield is good. I'm gonna sell it. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. Those, these have to go. And she still has a shit ton of cash. Where'd she get all that from? I'm gonna have to disenchant that. Probably disenchant that. That'll do. No, we aren't gonna mess with it right now. After your towns. Yeah, of course, bro. Well, at this point, it might be better if I close out the stream. And then uh, we do everything we need to do to refresh it, and then I reopen the stream, the stream, and then that'll push out a second notification, and uh, I can release a title to uh, the stream, letting everybody know that we have the issues fixed, and then we can carry on with the conversation that we are going to have. I'm at a point right now where I just had to do some inventory management, and then I could do that. <laughs> okay, man. Alright, then I'll keep on grinding. Don't forget to check inside the shop. <laughs> yeah, I suppose. But never underestimate the power of a push notification. And that's what restarting the stream would bring us. A push notification with a message to the audience stating that we have the issues fixed. Uh, glad you're hanging with us, babes. Thank you for watching the stream. I really appreciate your support. Love you. Yeah, I suppose. Talk to you then. Oh, there was a bounty on him. Dope. Do you have any more jobs for me? No? Okay. Hmm. You can't see me smile, so smile emoji. That's the best I can do. <laughs> okay. No, I don't need the shock necklace. Uh, I should probably give that Ring of the Squire to Fendal here. Fondle, come here. I have this pretty ring for you, Fondle. Don't take this the wrong way. I don't like you like that, bro. But I want you to have this ring. Okay. That's out of the way. Potions. Shit ton of potions. Do I have... Probably too many minor potions. Let's go over to the alchemy shop. I don't need to buy anything non-essential right now, but I do need to unload a ton of these minor magic potions. I probably should have taken a moment to sell some of uh, the enchantment. No, I don't need to worry about that. Do that later. I'm going to have to invest a few skill points into enchanting and blacksmithing pretty soon here. It won't be enough to just have the looted armor anymore. Take that. Have to remember to unload all the ingredients next time I go to the crib, too. Okay, I want to steal her giant's toe that she has behind the counter here. She should have it in one of these juniper berries. Yeah, I'm a thief. No, I don't care. <laughs> Do I? You're lying to me. It's trying to sell me shit. But I'm gonna take your healing potions. Thank you. You'll find tonics, salves, all of them. I need all of them. I need all the healing potions. Your Pardon me, oh, I need these healing potions too. The Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. For that. I have several elixirs for sale. Okay. Ah, Let's see what you got. So Ooh, ice wraith. Then. Ice wraith teeth has another invisibility. Canis root. Canis root is a paralyzed. Uh, Briarheart, forgot what that is. I don't think it's paralyzed. 
Glow Dust. That's just Fortified Destruction. Uh, that's probably the Ice Wraith Teeth there, so I don't have to buy that. Looks like she has a Nurn Root. White Salts, Wheat, White Cap. No, I don't need any of this stuff. But Ectoplasm and Glow Dust, too bad I'm not running Destruction. Uh, maybe later. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll play some Larry later. But right now, I still gotta run this. Okay. Draw the healer. I don't need that. Uh, Ice Wraith Essence. Probably don't need that. Don't need this. Uh, don't need the health potions that much, but need them more than I need all these magic potions. Let's get rid of 16 of these. Want to limit my stock. And then let's get rid of the potion of the defender, potion of the healer, potion of the warrior. Uh, I could have used that. Oh, fuck it. Uh, get rid of that one, too. Uh, let's get rid of the potion of the true shot as long as I have the droughts. Uh... I have the stamina, as that'll do. Uh, Potion of Illusion, let's get rid of that. And then I have these two. If I have the Draught of Health, that'll do. Draw the Knight, I could use that. Food, can I sell any of this? Don't want to give the... All the booze is mine, she can't have any of that. Uh, baked potatoes, I eat that stuff. Uh, we're good. We're hella good. Okay. Come back anytime. She's gonna sick her goons on me because I stole all of her shit. But, whatever. Give me the teeth, too. Okay. Restocked, ready to roll. A little bit lighter. All the good stuff. See if I can load anything in Bell Doors real quick. Let me know if you see anything you like. <sighs> Every oh, bit of this. Okay. That's nice not having the camera work and I can sit however I want. Hell yeah. <laughs> Get rid of that. Oh. Damn it, you're still broke. Why you know has money, man? And I told myself I was gonna wear the mask of Clavicus Vile to get better prices, but I'm just not wearing the thing. I might as well get rid of it. Well, I might as well put it away, I mean. No face cam today, indeed. I'm sorry, Shinra. Yeah, no, I had to I had to reset my catch last night for uh, Streamlabs OBS, and uh, I'm like, I'm having issues getting the face cam to work. Like, you could see when I switch, uh, like, if I uh, go to control alt delete, bring up task manager real quick, my face flashes just briefly. But I have, like, yeah, there's a couple of things that aren't working correctly. Like, I can't uh, get the Discord audio to function either. I was trying to have a conversation with Sour Patch, but, uh, no, that just wound up as a lengthy troubleshoot that drove everyone else away. So, it's, it's, just my voice and the and the gameplay today until I figure a few other things out. I'm planning on sorting this out with uh, Sour Patch after the stream today. So I, I, I'm sorry about that, man. I'm, I'm <laughs> it's it's kind of an unusual stream. Uh, not as many people have been tuning in today, but that's okay. A lot of things could explain that, <laughs> including my ineptness. Like, I just don't know how to set... I don't know how to organize this thing, man. Like, us old people. Like, our minds aren't flexible enough. We can't hash this out fast enough. <laughs> it's, it's been really tricky. Alright, I think this is the chest I got all my shit. No, this is just Dragon Bones. Okay, Dragon Bones stay in there. Barrel. The barrel has... Yeah, barrel has all my stuff. Gonna get... Gonna take that out. Need a new place for my Daedric artifacts. Can't just leave it in a barrel. That's kind of... Eh. That's not a good look, bro. So maybe if I put all the Daedric artifacts... Well, I just said barrel's not a good look. But here's a different barrel. Hold on. If I were to build a container here, I only need one chest. Just one chest. If I just get the things... Cupboard, dresser... No, 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 no chest here. Okay, weapons racks. Just one weapon plaque. Okay. Might be my best interest to go downstairs and build up my smith hall a little bit, or... Fuck that. Gonna build up the trophy hall. That's the perfect time to build a trophy hall, bro. So Shinra, man, how's your day been going? Not trying to make this all about me, bro. Life been treating you well? You staying safe, staying warm? 
Still grinding hard, bro. Okay, nails. That should be enough. Love it gives me blacksmith and experience too. That's just perfect. Tucson lots. I don't have logs. Damn it. Okay. Got to go get logs. Might be a job for another time. But I'm feeling it right now, Mr. Krabs. I just want to get this out of the way. I want a good place to store all my Daedric artifacts. Kind of disrespectful just putting them in that barrel, you know? It's three of them. I was hoping I'd have four of them, but the Black Star kind of fell through. That mission is hard. <laughs> okay, that, the, the Black Star mission is really hard. Okay, refined moonstone. It's like, not even gonna front about it. The Black Star mission is probably the most difficult. <laughs> it's probably one of the most difficult Daedric missions in the game. Those Daedra with Fireball just fuck you up, bro. Alright, gotta go to Half Moon. A lot of furious A clicking going on here, bro. Okay, it's X clicking. Ah! Fuck you, chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Where's everybody at? It's 2.42 a.m. They should be out. I think these vampires actually come out at night. Can't say for sure. I still remember that chicken who narked me out in the beginning. Not gonna nark anybody out now, are you, chicken? Yeah, you just lay there. You, you sleep in blood and you think about what you've done. Oh, she's gonna find her chicken. She's looking at the dead chicken. Like, what the hell? She's looking at me. <laughs> she's like, I know you killed this chicken, but I can't prove it. <laughs> I see the, I see the blood on your blade. The most restrained vampire ever. And she's still taking my money. Looks well, more annoyed. It's like I only have this chicken for appearances, but my real food is you. Okay. Never seen a lady who looked more like a vampire than her. Oh my god. <laughs> she just looked. She just slowly walked over to the chicken, looked at the dead chicken, and looked at me. It's like, what the fuck, bro? <laughs> it's like, I've, of course I killed the chicken. Like, what do you expect of me? Don't need no chickens narking us out. Man, got you. Good luck to you, bro. Oh, what's up again, Louie? Hey, man. How you doing, buddy? Alright. Gotta build. Fittings. Right, no, don't knock, don't knock over my cup. I, I know you, man. Okay, hinges were good. Okay, need. Don't need that much iron. That should be good. Alright. Might need an iron anger too. Yeah, you're a good kitty. Yes, you're a good kitty. Don't, don't, don't play with the cords. Don't, don't play with the cords. Good kitties don't play with cords, bro. Oh, yeah, that's right. You gotta craft. Okay, house. Perfect. While I'm at it, can I do the library? Okay. 
Yeah, it's between the armory, the kitchen, and the library. I've got to do the library, bro. Well, the armory or the library. I almost always do the library, but I'm, I'm going to need a lot of space. Uh, I don't know. That's hard. I do want to put everything that I find on display because we're also going to be getting the Azadel armor and we're going to be getting the Death Brand armor. And I, I want to have that on display along with the Ebony armor and the Ebony weapon. Uh, let's think on that a little bit. Bedrooms? No, we're not going to want bedrooms. And sorry, the muffle noise is Louis is rubbing up against the microphone right now. Louis a cat. Uh, so. No, don't want to remove the workbench from the cellar. We model a house into entryway? No, because that's going to make us lose all our booze. Uh, we're going to have to do... Let's see here. Louis, quit rubbing it. Louis, no! No, Louis! <laughs> Down, bro. You're a good cat, man. You're a little too rambunctious. <laughs> He's like, pay attention to me. What are you doing here? No, screw you. Screw what you're doing. Pay attention to me. Alright, we're going to do the enchanting tower, I think. Because bedrooms only let us have a kid, and I don't want no snot nose brat, man. Uh, well, actually, oh, I hate to say it, but I'm going to need a kid. I'm going to have to get married and, uh, and get a kid at some point if I want to complete all the uh, all the achievements here. So let's go ahead. Oh, this is a tough decision. But the library, all I'm going to be putting on display is the skill books, and I already have a bookshelf that I can display all of them, I think. Ooh, I'm going to sleep on it. Don't need any of this, really. So we're gonna do the slow walk back into the house. I really only need a couple of places to store shit in here. But having the trophy room is a big change. The trophy room is gonna give us a proper place to put all of our gems, all of our booze, all of our ingredients, and all of our Daedric items, most importantly. We have a chest for the dragon bones, we have a chest for the ingredients. We even have a good place for the booze, but, like, the Daedric artifacts are, they're special. They need to be treated like they're special. And I just had them shoved into a barrel. That's not good. We have to do something about that. Alright, so let's get a chest. Only had one lock. But I need an iron ingot for barrels, but we don't need, a, we don't need barrels. Only cupboards, huh? Display tall shelf wall shelves. Wow, this is a little underwhelming. This is really the trophy room, huh? So I guess... These trophy bases right here... Are where we're going to be putting our... Daedric artifacts. Let's make all these cupboards real quick. So most of the place is built. Oh, I see. I see, okay. Mmm. I'm not happy with this choice. I, I'm not happy with this choice. I should have picked the storage hall. What's my last load? What's my last quick save? Uh, the last quick save looks like it's before I killed the chicken. So I'm going to have to go back to before I kill the chicken because I've changed my mind. I don't want the trophy hall. I want the storage hall. Fuck you, chicken. <laughs> and now we're going to wait for her. <laughs> the chicken was going to die no matter what. I'm here to kill you, chickens. Oh my god, it's so weird not having my face in the corner. It feels unprofessional. You know? It feels half-assed. My whole setup today has just felt half-assed and lackluster. Uh, and I only have my, my own lack of forethought to blame for this. Uh, I only have myself to blame for this. 
yes, this happened and that happened and blah, blah, blah. It was ultimately my responsibility to keep my shit together and memorize everything and uh, remember all the important things about this, and I dropped the ball, and that's my bet. When you fuck up, it's important to own it, guys. And I fucked up. But don't you worry about that. I'm going to be able to get my shit together before the multiplayer event on Saturday. If I got to stay up all night working on this, I'm going to do it. If I have to drink the whole goddamn cot, the cot, cop of coffee, cot of coffee to stay awake, I'm going to get this shit figured out. Because again, this is embarrassing to be caught with my pants down like this. And that's what it feels like, to be caught with my pants down, man. It's embarrassing. Caught a poffy. I know. I'm not gonna try and keep you awake. But after the stream is done tonight, I'm gonna have to stay here and uh, work some things out with Sour Patch, get Streamlabs OBS figured out at least Uh, or, if I'm really being serious about this, switch my OBS over. Yeah, it would really, it would be really nice, babes. If I'm being serious about this, though, I need to switch my OBS client. I don't think using Streamlabs is going to be the way to go in the future. Simply because of what it's doing to my extensions. I don't like that. I'm going to have to go into Streamlabs to OBS, and I'm going to have to deauthorize access to it before I down before I uh, uninstall it. That's a really important one that I have to remember. I have to completely uh, what? I just lost my train of thought. <laughs> Shit, man! I'm going to have to do this soon before I totally pass out. Okay, that's the exterior. Okay, so I need shelves. Uh, hinge. Um, I need the hinges for the chest. Let's get one chest in here. Uh, cover and cover this way. And end table is more important. Lots, lots of barrels. That'll help. But I'm gonna have to make more chests. I think. You have two hinges and a lock. So furniture. Oh, I can't make any more of that. Let's get all of that. Then let's get. I'll, I'll be up with you when I'm done, baby. I promise. You won't have to wait too long for me. Thinking that's going to be the. Uh... Oh, <laughs> you're going to bed early, baby. Good night, babes. It's been great having you on. I always appreciate you being on the stream with me. Thank you for taking the time. When I'm done, I'm going to be up there. I can't wait to snuggle with you. Love you, too. Okay. Got all this arranged now. Ah, I gotta sit up straighter. <laughs> In, I never know with you, baby. <laughs> For your sake, I hope you get to bed soon. I know you have an early day tomorrow. We got a lot of stuff we need to do. You especially. Gonna throw in all of 
my ores in here for now, I think. Yeah. Quicksilver. Oh, I need the Quicksilver. No, I don't. I need Malachite. Shit. I'm tweaking. Silver ingot. Silver ingot I'm gonna save for the gems. Unusual. Oh, okay. It's not a bad storage hall. Not a great one either. Still need to get a few more chests in here. Let's see if I can build anything else right here. Furniture? No. Weapon racks? No. Missing fittings. Can at least build some shelves. But shelves are about all I can build. Damn. Okay. Uh, put away the silver. Yep. And it's it's you know it's a reasonably sized uh, little stash, but we can make this bigger. We can make this stash bigger. Gonna need a place for all my hides. Oh, there's a top floor. Oh wait, no, that's Skyrim. It won't record your display, huh? Well, ain't that a bitch, man. Makes me think... Like, is this stream actually gonna be recorded tonight? Is this gonna be posted on my channel? I don't even know. It could've reset that option as well. Oh, you did? Dope, man. Did you also figure out how to link Discord properly? Nice, 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 nice. Okay. We're on to something here. We're on to something here. That's awesome. Okay, I'm going to have to think of a place to just put my pelts real quick. Whoops. Jug is going to have to go back. At least you think so. Then we might as well give it a shot, I think. Another 30 minutes or so I'm scheduled for at least that long. Just gotta put this away. All the pelts, all, all the gems. Unusual gems staying with me, soul patches. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, let's see, just had a couple of more viewers pop in. I was hoping I'd get a chance to talk to more people, but, uh... Yeah, gonna have to keep this going for just a little bit longer, I think. Give me that extra 30 minutes and then we'll work on this. Okay. Thank you. Really appreciate you, man. You've been working hard trying to help me these last few days, and I appreciate every minute of it. I know I've said that too much, but it's because I do. You've been a good friend. Thank you. And if you need help with anything, just let me know, dude. At this point, I'd be ready to bend over backwards for you. Alright, just gonna toss that. Don't need the decoration so much. Let's get rid of all that. Carry weight's down to 217. That's the lightest I've been in like three episodes. Alright, let's get it. Oh, no. Remove it. There we go. I just spawned in to see that body just floating down, and he's, he's disappeared. The body's gone. Oh, here it is. <laughs> he went until he hit the lock. And it doesn't say that I've cleared the fortress yet, because I haven't killed Agnes for the Dark Brotherhood yet. You don't get a clear for this fort until either the Civil War or after you assassinate Agnes. Just little tidbits here. But I need the all-clear on as many of these cities that it will allow. 
well, on every city that'll allow. And if I can't inter interact with the NPC, that's the only time that I'll be allowed to respawn an NPC. Hey, hey what's up, baby? Can you please feed them? I fed them at noon. I'm on a pilgrimage to the shrine in the mountains to the northeast. I'm up. What? If you could please feed the kitties, I would really appreciate it. And then I'll get them in the morning. I'll, I'll be at the port. I'll do the 6 a.m. feed. These spoiled ass cats <laughs> have us get up at 6 a.m. to feed them, man. It's adorable, honestly. <laughs> it's the only reason why I'm still doing it. I kind of like it too, because, like, the small one, he just meows at me until I feed him. But uh, the big one, Louie, he'll actually snuggle up to me and start rubbing his nose and start breathing in my ear and stuff until I actually feed him. And it, it's, it's, it's like... Yeah. Like, <laughs> I'm amused. <laughs> like, I, I'd be lying if I said I didn't milk that a little bit. It's, it's nice having the fuzzy buddy up, you know? I love my cat, but he doesn't cuddle often anymore. So I gotta take what I can get. Did you just kill that fox? Fuck you, skeleton. Fuck you, wolf. And fuck you again, skeleton. Wait, not, what not? Oh, you're alive. Hey, what up, bro? Okay, fox is alive. We're gonna keep going. Alright, I think there was an altar right here? Yep, right here. I saw another skelly bro around here. And a necromancer of some type. Hope he was stupid enough to pick a fight with that elephant. Then I can raid his body with no consequence. But I don't see him anywhere. Oh, what's this? Ooh, it's a fresh grave. One of those little off-map tidbits. That's cool, man. Rorikstead is right beyond that hill over there. Is this a Rorikstead grave, or is this like a, a necromantic ritual site? That's cool, dude. That's a cool little find. Oh, here they are over here. Looks like a storm... Oh, wow! An actual vanilla encounter between storm cloaks and Imperials. You don't encounter this often. You know what? Skyrim belongs to the Nords. I'm going to be joining the Imperials later on, but that's only because I really hate the Thalmor. I, I, I know, that sounds a little bit twisted. Hear me out. The Thalmor are trying to divide and conquer. But it's my opinion that that's why I need to help the Empire, because a, a united Empire is a strong Empire, and it's one that's capable of repelling the Thalmor. Or, like, I want to... I'm almost inclined to do the peace treaty through the Dragonborn quest. But I feel like that would be a bit of a cop-out for this 100% run. I want to participate in a couple of the siege battles. So, how's it feel, lady? You're the lone survivor. You know for the Empire! <laughs> Fuck them all. But my real opinion is fuck them all. Fuck them all to death. Right, Fendal? Fendal agrees. <laughs> it's one of the few times you can get away with murder is when you encounter these guys fighting like that. <laughs> and I, I'll, I'd be lying to you all if I said that I wasn't a bit of a murder hobo. And for anybody just tuning in, I'm so sorry that I don't have the face, like, I don't have the webcam displaying right now. I had a few technical difficulties regarding my extensions yesterday, so I reset the catch on my Streamlabs OBS. And now I've been having difficulties presenting webcam. So I'm, uh, I'm aware I don't usually have uh, my uh, webcam hidden during gameplay. I find that to be just a little bit odd, personally. When I see a streamer that doesn't have their webcam on display. 
like it, it just uh, it almost gives the impression that they're not able to communicate with you as well. I don't know why. I, that sounds a little bit silly, I know. But I, I understand the feeling that comes with that. It's what I'm trying to convey here. But uh, I will be sorting that out after the stream tonight. It's just important to me that I get this full stream out and open. I'm hoping that the recording is still going. Oh, yeah, there's a cave here. Dope. Be careful. I think it's more giants. And, oh, yeah, it's a giant. Do I have a greater soul gem? Do I have a great... Oh, yes. And it's unoccupied. Perfect. Okay. Well, you are getting in the gem. Let's go, Fendal. Fendal, aggro him. Fendal, aggro him. I think he got him. Yeah, I'm going to have to use the vegetable soup. And for those of you just joining in, hard mode means yes, I am playing on Legendary. Any minute now, this giant could send me and Fendal to the Cloud Kingdom. And there wouldn't be much I could do about it. Okay. We got him. No exploits, but a little bit of cheese. And a lot of mammoth cheese. And we got him. We're good to go. Ulag, like you sold his message. This is where you sold his messages. Yeah, she, our girl uh, Isolde is a little bit shady. She she a secret drug dealer. She she's the plug in White Run. For those of you who didn't know, <laughs> the little skooma incident. <sighs> Excuse me, man. Indigestion. Acid reflux because I'm an old man. I'm an old man at 28 as a bitch. Oh god, that one's yeah. That one was just gratuitous. I'm sorry. Excuse me, dude. I'm not doing that on purpose. I swear. All right, let's get it. Yeah. But it has relieved the heartburn a little bit. I've just been suffering this like uh, it's like I sit in one place for too long, and that especially kind of like. Ugh, clenches up the organs of a little bit. Gives it a tighter feeling. Like, it's important to get up every few hours and stretch. If you stream for a long period of time like I do, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Also, make sure you get out and walk once in a while. Like, after a big meal, just go on a nice walk, bro. I promise you, you'll feel a lot better. That's a secret to a long, healthy life right there, my friend. Walk around and stretch. And enjoy yourself. Enjoy the little things. Like killing both the Stormcloaks and the Empire. Fuck them both. Broken Fang Cave. Okay, let's get it. I think I collected Namrin's family sword back there. Hello? I want to say I did. Oh! Good thing. I got Dawnbreaker on me. And I'm still under the effects of vegetable soup. Which gives me that plus one per second stamina regeneration. Oh my god! Wasn't anticipating Skelly Posse. And this is Broken Fang Cave. I think a quick save right in front of it. Yep, here we go. Never should have what, bitch? Nope. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Okay. Change of plan. Stamina. I need a lot more stamina. I need carry weight. Uh, let's go with... Uh... I need enchanting this time. So, let's go... No, I'm really heavily relying on uh, the power attacks from Vegetable Soup in this playthrough. So, instead, I think for now, for now, I'm going to put it on Standing Strike. Savage Strike, I mean. Sorry, Standing Power Attacks do 25% bonus damage with a chance to decapitate. Fuck yeah, that's what we were missing. Okay. We're live! Don't you dare fuck with Vendal. Your 
You touch my man Fondle, you're gonna get the swords. Oh, sorry, Fondle. Let's take that. Okay. We're alive. Perfect. And, as always, I gotta collect all the booze. But these... Oh my god, these party animals, they drank it all. Every bottle in this cave is empty. Ooh, Dwarven Armor of Health. That actually might be better than the enchantment that I'm getting on my current one, Eminent Restoration. Yeah, I'm gonna switch that for Armor of Health. Perfect. I just tolerated Restoration because it was a better armor than I had before. But my previous Steel Armor Plate had 30 points health uh, bonus, so I think this is going to help us out a lot. I might actually have enough max health to tank a Fireball right now, so I could do the a Night to Remember and play that drinking game with Sam now, but I'm going to wait just a little bit longer. And oh boy, my carry weight is not looking pretty here. And we have plenty of loot to take from this place. I just wasted that shot. But that doesn't matter. I gotta cheese the shit out of this Master Vampire or I'm gonna die. He's strong enough to basically hit me. Like one hit me. Okay, there we go. It's not an exploit. These are mechanics in the game. <laughs> These are legitimate te <laughs> these are legitimate in-game mechanics. So they're not exploits. Vegetable soup is just pretty overpowered. What do you want me to carry? Uh, that's the tag that I forgot to add this time. What's the no exploit tag? Damn it. Okay, next time. N no time. Uh next next time. One time. That time. Next time, we're going to put in the no exploit tag. Captain Soul Gem, Mystery Tolera. I've already read it, okay. But. Give me that armor back. I didn't know this thing was here. Back. What do you want me to carry? I want to take. Oh, yeah, that's right. I gave them all. I, I gave them all the shit that we got from. Uh, uh, the Mark Arth Quest, whatever it's called. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Okay. And I need to keep the Dwarven Armor of Health. Did I really sell that last set of armor? I think I did. What a waste. I should have disenchanted that. Okay. I think we got time for one more dungeon, so we're gonna hit it. Yeah, I already searched this. Okay, any booze in here? Any booze at all? Just one bottle. Validate me. Give me one bottle. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, nothing. Just, just alchemy. Ow. Frostbite Venom. Gross. I can't drink that. Well, I can. I don't want to drink. Wine! Perfect. One bottle. Thank you. Now I can leave this place. Yep, yep, that's it. We're getting out of here. That's it. That, he was making a meal of those people. These gross bastards. Apparently the vampires in this game, they don't just drink people. They eat people. Damn, look at all these empty bottles. Just everywhere, scattered to the four corners of the cave. Okay. And this last place coming up here is a puzzle. And I need some large antlers real quick. Let's see if... I think my archery is still shit. No, nope, he's getting away. Oh, that's inhumane to just let him run like that. But I need large antlers. I need a few small antlers and a few large antlers for the trophies in my house. I don't want to just send Fondle off. He's my steward for, uh, for uh, Lakeview. But he's also my only, my only and most reliable follower. 
and I can't afford to lose him like that. Jugajir's monument. Okay, gonna take the flower. Assisting deal. I feel like there's more importance to this place than just the monument itself. Might as well mine the Corona real quick. Get a bottle of water, out of coffee. Got nothing to drink down there, nothing to do with my hands. Exactly. Okay, we're done. <laughs> That's just to see if y'all are paying attention. <laughs> Let's see what the map looks like. What's this area up here? I know I'm missing something. Oh, duh. Transmute ore. Boop. This guy's gonna kill me. Oh, he's gonna fucking kill me. Oh, boy. Putting those healing potions to work. Oh, boy. Yes! Oh, Sabercats 5, me 1. Survived our first Sabercat encounter. Oh, this account's making progress, man. And it only took, like, level 71 handed to pull it off. This is just impressing upon me the importance of enchanting and blacksmithing. I, I, I've been slacking on that shit. I really need to get a move on. I've been dumping all my points into combat stats. Because I've been afraid of overpowering the enemies, uh, uh, like, too early on. So that I couldn't fight. But now I'm already encountering highwaymen and chiefs. Now it's a good time to start putting in a blacksmithing. So on the next run through, when I log in on Tuesday, I believe it's going to be for our next Skyrim playthrough. Like I'm going to be focusing on getting ores, getting enchantments. It's going to be a little dull. It's going to be a little grindy, but that's okay. That gives me t more time to talk with you guys while I hash stuff out. And we're going to have a new OBS set up. We're going to have webcam back. We're going to have bits. We're going to have. Uh, many games for you guys to participate and for I as well. It's going to be fun. But for now, we're approaching the very last location. We need to get under our belt for the night. I lied about that monument being the last place. It wasn't what I thought it was going to be. I thought that that was going to be, like, uh, the pillar puzzle in the middle of the plains, but no, no, that monument, I'm actually not familiar with it. I don't remember what that quest that line that's attached to. It could be a night to remember, but somehow I doubt it. But this right here, I definitely remember. Or definitely do not remember. This ain't the place I thought it was. Oh, shit. Man, I quit apologizing. You're doing it anyway. Your inner self doesn't matter. If your external self is doing the thing, that you're doing a thing. Okay, I didn't pick up the ball. All right. Okay, don't need the tomatoes. What the fuck is this place? This isn't what I want. Boosh! I don't want to do this. Yeah, for real, I can't remember this place for the life of me. Well, I do, but I don't. Like, it looks familiar. But, like, what is this related to? 
I think this is a standalone location. This isn't related to any quest line. That's cool, man. Ah, oh, but I'm running out of time for the stream. Yeah, I don't have time to do this whole place today. I'll just fight my way to the gate, and that's where we will end it for the night. Unless this dragon has anything to say about that. If the dragon comes over here knocking, it's like, what's up, bro? Then I got a dragon fight. That's how we end the stream. Kind of want him to. Hey, dragon! You'd be a great way to end the stream. Dragon! Oh, he sees us. Oh, wait, no, he doesn't. Damn it! Got my hopes up for nothing. This time I'm not gonna get kill cam to one shot with a bitch. That was a blood dragon, judging by the tail. So he actually probably could one shot me. Staff of Courage? No, I don't need Staff of Courage. Do not need Staff of Courage. But what's this location up here? Is Mountain Pass? That's some type of Mountain Pass. I want to fight that dragon. Here he is. Here he goes. Here we go. Dragon fight. It is a blood dragon. Oh, fuck. Gotta be really careful about getting one shot by this thing. I think I can stagger him if I keep laying on the power strikes. Vegetable soup will help. Okay. Our character is a Nord, so we have some good frost resistance. We got pretty lucky that he only does frost damage. And he doesn't seem to do a lot of frost damage with it. Gonna have to wait and see what his physical attacks look like. It'd be better... No, I need to save my magic for. Yeah. It's better if he attacks me instead of Fendal. At least without Ice Breath. Where is he gonna land? Let's see if I can get a shot off. Have very few points in archery. But I got enough, I think, to make some kind of difference. Alright, let's go. Where is he going to land? If I can just get him to land somewhere instead of flying around, that'll give me a better chance. Now he's going to be hovering again. Alright. It's going to take forever if he keeps going like that. Breaker, glass sword. Oh fuck, he just took out three quarters of my health bar. Oh shit. Gotta let Fendal do some tankage right here. Holy shit. That was close. I'm not going to be doing the rest of this fight tonight if I die, but I just don't want to have to redo this whole encounter. Ah, oh, for fuck's sakes. Guess I'm going after his tail. Fendal's pretty low in health here. At least lower than the dragon is. Got away from the land again. Oh, that wasn't close enough. Oh, shit. Oh, man. I really, really could use some heal leather right now. Or at least healing hands. I... I could have sworn that I purchased Healing Hands earlier in the day. Earlier in the like in a previous stream, I must have bought it at some point. 
No, he's going straight for Fondle. This is seriously my highest DPS I have. Using range is not going to be good for me here. But if Fondle goes down, it might be what I have to do. He can kill me. He can kill Cammy right now if I don't eat. Okay. Bring it. Okay. He's going back for final. Oh shit. Okay, gonna recharge Dawnbreaker. Yeah. Let's use a couple of my greater souls. And along and the grand scheme of things, using those for enchantments wouldn't help me much. Right now I need every little bit of DPS I can get. Back up faster, back up faster. Oh shit. I'm trying to interrupt him whenever I can for Fondle's sake. Fondle's about to go down. Fuck, I just have to eat as many potions as I got. That's all I got. That's not good. I have a vigorous potion, and I have these uh, minor healings left. Not to three, dragon! Oh, fuck. I think Fondle was at like the bottom tenth of his health bar there. And I just went through all my potions trying to stay above his kill cam hit. Oh, uh, GG. GG, Blood Dragon. GG. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Oh, it's time. Just had that final dragon encounter. And with that, that's gonna be the end of the stream. We're ending things on a positive note. Gotta take a look at the map real quick. That's how much land we covered today. It doesn't seem like much. But that is at least nine separate dungeons that we've got under the belt. And we've got the storage room set up at the house. So we're going to have an easier time storing all our Daedric artifacts, our ingots, our, bout, our leather, our hides in the future. That's huge. That's huge. Next, I think I'm gonna put up an armor stand instead of the book sh instead of the library this time because I don't really give a damn about displaying all the journals and notebooks. I'm just gonna have like chests for that or something. But with that, once again, that's the end of the stream. Thank you so much for for uh, following us and uh, checking in with us tonight. Really appreciate all of you guys. Uh, our multiplayer day is going to be Saturday, and it's looking like it might begin as early as 7 p.m., but it could start as late as 9 p.m. Please check our Discord. If you're a member of our Discord, if you clicked on that link that Stream Elements is plugging right now, and make sure that you vote in our poll like your opinion counts, and I can't wait to see you guys on Saturday. I'm going to get this uh, Discord stuff hashed out right now. I'm going to get the webcam revealed, and I'm going to make sure that everything is running smoothly for us. This has been Dr. Greenstone. I had a great time, as always, with all of y'all. And I want all of you guys to have a great day. Sour Patch. I'm ending the stream, and I'm going to hop on Discord with you.